Yeah. Yo, stick to the script or get crucified and hung on the cross These are the scars that you bear when you becoming the boss Don't let the negativity energy interject Stay on D and when they fumble then you intercept Only roll with who you know, keep your shit in check Only go when it's go time, don't miss a step Only go with the flow when there's no obstruction Why the fuck would you flow over no production? Don't put your trust in the system, understand corruption Stay focused on the prize and the prize is nothing Don't end up living all of your life expecting something The shit is kinda disgusting, what's your function? Know that you've been there for trading This the game all hard mode These vigilantes been plotting my people resist the barcode Stick to the guard code No man alive could ever tread on my life yeah. Know that I got God the source, I am the light yeah. Even in the dark I absorb and gain sight yeah. Fuck these broken wings, I still can take flight uh. No weapon formed against me, shall pass a nigga that's law uh. We soon shall return to the throne, same as before uh. The story has been written, the writing's all on the wall Resist the barcode, stick to the guard code Don't be lacking, nigga, stay disciplined You have no idea what type of shit you in What type of demons that you dealing with, they listening Responsible for your programming, conditioning We can win, it's just about positioning your position. Be careful what you think and what you mentioning So always keep your focus on winning So you won't be surprised when you get this shit, this is it May your soul find peace yeah. May these rhymes find beats uh. Dropping knowledge to say the least, the war is on, no time to retreat. Only the strong survive, ain't no room for the weak. As long as I'm alive with a voice, I'ma speak. And I ain't into following the crowd, I'm unique. And I refuse to fall into the hands of defeat. Peace. No man alive could ever tread on my life. Yeah. Know that I got God the source, I am the light. Yeah. Even in the dark, I absorb and gain sight. Yeah. Fuck these broken wings, I still can take flight. Uh. No weapon formed against me shall pass the nigga that's law. Uh. We soon shall return to the throne, same as before. Uh. The story has been written, the writing's all on the wall. Resist the barcode, stick to the guard code. Hey, 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 what's up, everybody? Y'all know what it is. Y'all know what it is. Y'all know what it is. Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. Yes, sir. My dreams was the same when you lay around. <laughs> what's up, everybody? Salute, salute, salute. We're going we're gonna to do a special, special one today. We're going to do play by play off, play by play. Nephew. Nephew felt like he wanted to do it, man. Nephew with him. Salute to everybody showing up in the chat, man. Salute, salute, salute to everybody listening on their devices, man. Rather at home, rather on their phones, in their cars, at home, or on their jobs, man. Salute, salute, salute to each and every one who's tuning in, man. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So now, me and Nephew thought it'd be a good idea, man. We're going to do the play-by-play -play with the Lakers and... Uh, Salute to Salute to everybody that's in the chat, man, showing up, man. Salute, salute, salute. Let me see. Yes, sir. What's happening? Y'all can hear me, right? I put my other headphones on, man, them big ones. Them big headphones that I you know, was, was wearing down my... Uh, Weighing down my ears, man. I had to put on a more comfortable head headset. 
But um, yeah, man, salute to everybody, man. What's happening? What's happening? Y'all come on in, grab a seat. Come on in and grab a seat, man. And let's have some fun, man. Let's. What y'all think, man? You know, oh shit, this man, they ain't playing. They done started early. And if you let me let you in, yeah, man, they done. Let me go turn it on. Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. I can hear what's good, on. Huh? Man, yeah. they don't start the damn thing early, bro. Go on and do your thing, man. Let me go get the turning on my TV shit. All right, hey. I got you. All right. Salute to everybody in the chat, man. Appreciate y'all being here. Salute Daryl, Shift, Melvin. We got a little, you know, Pelicans versus Lakers play-by-play playing matchup. Because we got Jonas Valanciunas. He's at the line. He knocked down the first free throw. And he and he you know starts to score off in this game. So one oh lead for the Pelicans. We're just now underway. Salute Daniel. Just now underway in this ball game. And Valentunis, he knocks down the second free throw, makes it a two oh lead. And D Lo got the inbound. He's gonna give it to A D, A D to Braun. Braun being guarded by Herb. It's gonna be a tough task for Herb on this one. Braun skips it over to D Lo. D'Lo's going to get a screen from Braun. D'Lo's trying to turn the corner. He throws the alley-oop to AD, and AD smokes the layup. Here comes Valanciunas, B.I. with the ball right now. B.I.'s being guarded by Reese. B.I., he finds Zion back door for a dunk. And he gives the Pelicans a 4-0 lead. B.I. with some good vision right there, keeping his head up, able to find his teammate, sneaking back door. He gets a slam, and now we got a foul on the Pelicans. It's going to be a sideline out of bounds for the Lakers. Look at his replay right here. B.I. with his head up. And, you know, once Zion get the ball down low and able to get to that launching pad, that's two. As we got LeBron James with the ball, LeBron finds D'Lo. D'Lo, a deep three. He bricks it. We get a rebound by Valanciunas. He gives it off to Zion. Zion's going to push some pace here. Zion being guarded by Braun. Zion gives it off to Valanciunas, who's going to spot up for three. He's short. And with a head full of steam, here comes LeBron James. Pelicans do a good job of retreating, but we got CJ on LeBron. Pelicans go after help. And LeBron's taking his time. He gives it off to D'Lo. He wants it right back. He gets it right back. He skips it over to Reeves. Reeves lines up a three, and Reeves knocks it down. Nothing but net. Lakers on the board with a Reeves three. LeBron took his time. New Pelicans are going to panic with the mismatch. He's able to find Reeves for three. Here comes CJ. CJ with a pump fit. He draws two off of that. B.I. is going to spot up for a three, and B.I. is going to lace one. Back-to-back -back trade balls from both teams. Pelicans up 7-3. Plenty of time left in the first. Is AD. AD gives it off to Braun. Braun gives it back to D'Lo. D'Lo, he's going to get a screen from AD. AD rolls. D'Lo attacks. D'Lo gets fouled. He's going to get two free throws. D'Angelo Russell. Good little hesitation there. They had to respect AD's role, and he took advantage of it. He's able to draw a foul. And D'Lo knocks down the first free throw. He got one more coming up. Appreciate everybody being here, man. Hit that like button, share, join, subscribe, show some love. And let's just watch a good basketball game right now. And D'Lo goes two for two. As we got B.I. with the ball. And B.I. being guarded by Hachimura, he dumps it down to Valanciunas. Valanciunas with a little post work, and he gets a little hook to go over AD. And that's going to be key for the Pelicans, man. They got to try to work the ball to Valanciunas and force AD to play some on-ball post defense. Because we got Reeves trying, to, Reeves trying to weave through traffic. He gives it off to D'Lo. D'Lo to Braun. Braun's going to line up a three, and he's going to knock it down. Nine eight lead for the Pelicans. We got Bi coming across. Bi hits the pull up jumper, and Bi knocks it down from the midi. Here comes Ad now. Ad on a face up. Ad with a little body bump, jump hook. He gets that to go. A little push shot from close range. He gets that to go. So some back and forth action right now. 
Here comes B.I. now. B.I. swings it over to Valanchunas. He wants it back. Good denial by Hachimura. And C.J. with the ball. A little crossover move on Reeves. He finds Zion. Zion with the ball. Trying to barrel his way into the paint. He gets a tough layup. Physical layup to go. 13-10 lead for the Pelicans. Both teams responding here early. We got LeBron James in the post. LeBron, he finds AD. AD's going to attack again. And AD's going to miss a little close shot. Rebound Valanciunas. He gives it off to CJ. CJ with a hesitation move. CJ with a little push shot. He misses it. He gets his own offensive rebound. And he gives it out to BI so BI could reset it. BI gets a screen from Zion. BI with a pull up in the mid range. He's off. Rebound Reeves. D'Lo on the attack. D'Lo finds a cutting AD, and AD gets, gets fouled right there. He's going to get two free throws. And AD missed the first free throw. He got one more on the way. And the second free throw for AD is up and good. He splits it, goes one out of two, 13-11 lead for the Pelicans. Herb Jones, he gives it off to Valanchunas, Valanchunas to CJ, CJ to BI, and JV wants that ball in the post. He's going to try to back down. He spins baseline. He goes reverse. AD blocks him. AD wasn't having none of that. And here comes LeBron. LeBron skips it over to D'Lo, three ball, D'Lo catches it. That's good transition offense right there by the Lakers. They turned defense into offense. A block by AD and a three ball by D'Lo. Here comes Zion. Lakers take the lead now. Let's see what Zion does. We got LeBron backing up on Zion, and that's what Zion got to work on. Zion gives it off to Herb. Herb gets closed out, but he attacked the paint. Right-hand layup is good with the offhand. Herb Jones right there, good attack. And here comes D'Lo. D'Lo with a step-back trade ball. He knocks it down. You got to be careful with D'Lo, man. When he starts getting hot, man. He be hitting them threes. He gives the Lakers a two-point lead, 17-15. Almost halfway through the first. And CJ pulls up a three, and CJ knocks it down. He gives the Pelicans a lead right back. Back and forth game right now. Here comes D'Lo. D'Lo off the bounce. He's going to get a screen from AD. He finds AD on a roll. AD goes up. Reverse layup is good. Lakers back ahead. Now here comes B.I. Now look like it's going to be a track meet early. B.I. is being guarded by Reeves. Gets a screen from Valanchunas. B.I. all the way to the rim. He loses the ball. Zion recovers it. Shot clock is going to be at 10. LeBron sagging off on Zion. And Zion still not figuring out what to do against that defense. C.J. pull up three ball. That's off. Rebound Braun. LeBron James got the ball now. LeBron James being guarded by Zion. LeBron James picks up his dribble. He finds A.D. in the post. A.D. is going to face up and go to work here on Valanchunas. A.D. trying to barrel his way through. Turn around, little hook shot. No good. Rebound Valanchunas. Gives it off to Herb. Herb going attack. Herb gathers. Right hand left. He gets, okay, they're going to call a goal 10 right there. LeBron thought he had a block, but they're going to call a goal 10. Pelicans back ahead. Twenty to nineteen lead for the Pelicans. We got D'Lo bringing the ball across half court. He sees two. He finds Rui. Rui in the mid range pull up. He knocks it down. That was too easy. They sent two to D'Lo on a little half court uh, trap. He finds Rui and Rui pulled up in the mid range for an easy cash. Here comes CJ with a spin move. He gives it off to Zion. Zion lines up a three. Zion short on the three. Rebound AD. And Zion going to have to take some of those shots now. You got to have some. Hey, LeBron pull up from three. LeBron's off. Rebound BI. Zion's going to have to build some confidence in that shot. Zion gets it in the post. He's attacking AD. He's falling. He turns the ball over. Here comes LeBron in transition. LeBron gathers, goes up. He smokes a layup. And AD goes out of bounds. And ball's going to go over to the Pelicans. LeBron smoked a layup right there. And it's going to be a timeout in the action. After the break, it should be Pelicans ball. Yeah, Marcus. But so far, so good. You know, Pelicans coming out with some better energy right now. 
um, you know, unlike last game. And I don't want to hear anything about the Lakers selling, man. These motherfuckers sweating hard, man. They playing hard, man. They playing good basketball, man. Let's not pollute the game and taint the game, man. These dudes playing hard, man. Stop all these narrative dudes tanking and trying to lose and avoiding this and avoiding that. Nah, man. Come on, man. These boys playing at the highest stage of basketball, man. They're playing hard and they want it. Oh, yeah, Marcus. You're going to have to go to work. Come on now. Ain't no excuse, man. Like, he just trying to live off his, his God-given abilities and his, his, his physicalities and his strength. Well, you know what's going to end up uh, happening, Marcus? Zion's always going to have a cap on his on his abilities, bro. Because once you come playoff time and teams taking away what you're good at in a seven-game series, you looking mighty limited. Yo, salute, Conley. You looking mighty limited come playoff time. All that little 82-game season is all up and down, and you, you know what I mean? And it's it's like a freeway game yeah it's cool bro like you could do your little power dunks and you know do all but hey man when the matchups get tough in the playoffs man they scout you for real for real you got to be able to knock down a jumper bro man is anybody gonna play any defense <laughs> i mean nah you know they 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 they, they going up and down early <laughs> They're going up and down early. Damn. <laughs> I'm like, look at this dumb shit. Yeah, but but Lakers can't afford to do that, though. They're older. They can't afford by third quarter, fourth quarter. They're going to be wild. They can't afford to do that. Yeah, no doubt. Yep. Yep. You know what I mean? You already see LeBron missing layoffs, huffing and, huffing and yeah. puffing. So. You know, so yeah, they're gonna have to slow that down. Most definitely. Salute uh just win. Salute Letitia. Salute everybody who came in, Letitia. There, I don't know if I called that by, but everybody shit, so I won't miss nobody. <laughs> salute, salute, salute. Yes, sir, yes, sir, yes, sir. It's crazy, man. But yeah, so so Rose out tomorrow. Yep. Ain't no problem. Nah, ain't, ain't no problem, man. We just, you know what I mean? We just gonna have to do what we gotta do, man. I just I just hope he, you know, he gets better. That 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 neck, I don't know if he got some stiffness or some nerves. I don't know what's going on, but right. it gotta be something. See, and that was the that was the reason too. Uh, uh, the six seed, I won six seed, man. Everybody, rest, yeah, yeah, you know what I'm saying, was able to get, you know, now he ain't playing tomorrow and we win, and still he can get that. That's still a five, six day, you know, on him to rest. So, yeah, you know, and and Duncan, now I don't know what Duncan's situation, I don't know how his back is, but I think, you know. I think I saw some news that's saying that he's probable. Okay, okay. So whatever that means. Now, I don't want no rush back shit now. You know what I mean? I don't. But they saying he probable. So hopefully that means that the medical staff, they, it's, you know. Exactly. Exactly. I got uh, just win. I got I got the Lakers and the, and the Warriors mm. winning tonight as Larry Nance. He just missed a dunk. Here come the Lakers in transition up one. LeBron, little fading shot. He misses it. AD misses a putback. And ball goes out of bounds. And the refs, they're going to keep it with LA. Hey, Lucy. I, let me, I meant to text you, Lucy, but I ain't I ain't know if you wanted to do. Um, let me send you the link. I didn't know if you wanted to do the. Uh, I should have. I apologize because I should have texted you. As soon as I said I was going to text you, then I got busy. And um, I didn't get to text you. So I apologize. Hit the link. Hit the link, Lucy. Hey, what's up? 
Salute, Hong. Salute, West Ham. Yeah, I, I, Salute, I, Lucy. I, I, I apologize. All good. As we got I mean, okay. Spencer Dinwiddie in the game, he pulls up in the mid range. He misses it. And Ingram skies for the rebound. And Ingram, he's going to take it across half court here. Ingram, he's being guarded by AD. He gives it off to Nance. Nance right back to Ingram, who gives it to CJ. CJ's going to attack. He got AD on him. He finds Nance in the corner. Nance hesitates. He shoots the three. He knocks it down. Normally, once you hesitate, that follows with a miss. But Nance is able to convert the three ball in the corner. He gives the Pelicans a two-point lead, 23-21. Here comes Reeves. Reeves behind the back into a three ball. Reeves is off. Rebound Nance. He gives What's it up, off Mr. to B.I. Man? B.I. guarded by Reeves. Let's see if he goes to work here. He attacks. He goes up. He misses. And they're going to say ball goes off to the Lakers. A lot of contact right there. No call. It's going to be Lakers ball. With the Lakers down two, we got Dinwiddie taking the ball across half court. He's being pressed by B.I. Reeves got it. Herbs is guarding him. And Reeves looks like he turns the ball over off a simple crossover. It's going to be Pelican's ball. I like that matchup. If I could get Herb on Reeves, that should be able to negate anything Reeves tries to do. Here we go now. We got the inbound. We got Trey Murphy getting ready to inbound to Herb Jones. Herb Jones takes it across half court here. He gives it off to Zion. Zion and Nance. Herb on a handoff catch. He gets it right back from Nance. Herb with a mid-range, and he knocks that down. Now, my apologies, that's Trey Murphy. Trey Murphy knocks down the mid-range pull-up. Trey Murphy gives the Pelicans a four-point lead. 25 to 21, and they're applying some full court pressure on the Lakers here. Dinwiddie gets it across. Dinwiddie draws two, tries to dump it down to Rui. Rui gets hemmed up, and they're going to call out of bounds. It's going to stay with the Lakers. As we got Dinwiddie on the inbounds, he shoots a three ball. He misses it. Rebound Trey Murphy. Trey Murphy's going to take it across. He gives it off to Zion. Zion to Herb. And what's the call here? Wow, they call a, a, a offensive foul here. They're going to call Zion for a bad screen. And the ball's going to go over to the Lakers. That's a soft call by the referee right there. Come on. This, this, hey, man, this playoff basketball now is going to be a level of physicality. Come on now. That's a terrible call. That's a terrible call. I mean, come on now. As we get a break into the action here, Pelicans up 25 to 21, about 256 left in this first quarter. As we got, okay, salute Tamar. Salute Rhonda. Nance didn't have that three-point shot. Yeah, man, Zion got no excuses, man. Come on now. I don't understand that. All you got to do is just put in the work. It's not hard at all. Repetitions get your mu um, muscle memory down. It's just they don't want to put in the repetition it takes to improve your shot. The fact that you got to shoot through your fatigue man come on they gotta take thousands of shots man and the and the real work begins when you fatigued that's when the real work begins on your shooting you know not just oh i'm gonna take 100 shots and uh, yeah i'm gonna call it a day nah not if you're trying to get better at it you know so we'll see what he does he's young he got plenty of time but it's not a good sign that you an injury prone player and you still not improving that shot. Blake Griffin did it. So let's see what Zion does.
Mm, LeBron is the king of flops, so. Yeah, Pelicans just going to have to overcome all of that. You know, everybody knows what, you know, the history with the Lakers and getting foul calls and stuff like that. But if the Pelicans want to, you know, advance and secure that seven seed without having to worry about playing against either the Kings or the Warriors, they got to, you know, do what they got to do, man, overcome everything. Because uh, the playoffs is about overcoming, you know, so. Let's see. Let's see what they get cracking. They're up four right now early. It's a better start than they had last game. And uh, plenty of time left in the ball game. So they got to keep it going. I still got Lakers winning this game. I just think that they're the better team. But it doesn't mean anything. The Pelicans could easily win. As we getting ready to get back into the action here, we're going to have D'Lo on the inbound. He inbounds it to Dinwiddie. Dinwiddie's racing across half court. He's being guarded by Alvarado. And here comes D'Lo now. He gives it off to Torian Prince in the corner. Torian Prince misses the corner three, rebounds Zion. Outlets to Alvarado. Alvarado, a deep pass. He finds Trey Murphy back to Zion. Zion, bully ball attack, right-hand layup is good. Zion knifes into the lane. We talking about his shot, but he can do that pretty well, what he just did. Bully ball his way to the lane, and if he gets that launching pad, he's going to go up and score. Here comes D'Lo now off of AD screen. AD's holding his face. D'Lo knocks down the mid-range pull-up. AD holding his face. Man, play basketball, man. Sick of seeing this dude sometimes. Everything hurts him. As we got Zion. Zion. Turn around. Jumper. He knocks it down. That's a tough layup right there. Probably with some contact. Either way, he gets the score to go. He makes it a two-possession lead for the Pelicans. 29-23. Here comes D'Lo. D'Lo, he's going to take a step back mid-range shot. He misses this one. And here comes Zion with the rebound. Zion, he's going to outlet it to Trey Murphy. Trey Murphy. Oh, his foot on the line. Long two. He misses it. And then when he gets a running rebound, gives it off to D'Lo. D'Lo pulls up from three. He knocks it down. D'Lo already three for three from three-point range. As we got Alvarado, he gives it off to Nance. Nance to Trey Murphy. Trey Murphy threw up a wild shot. He didn't get that, get that to go, but Zion gets it back, and he throws it down. Larry Nash got the offensive rebound. Nice feed to Zion, and Zion did the rest. Here comes Dinwiddie with the ball. Dinwiddie's trying to get it to D'Lo. Good ball denial by Alvarado. And what's the call here? And now I believe they call a foul. And, and, and is that a tech on Alvarado? And who is that? Scott Foster? Who's the technical foul on? That's what I want to know. Who's the technical foul on? Because Scott Foster... He just can't wait to make himself be seen in the game. He's got under a minute left in the game. D'Lo running his mouth, front running. And let's see how this plays out. Plenty of game left, D'Lo. You front running right now. You playing great basketball, I'll give you that. But you front running right now, homie. See what we got. Refs talking it over. I think Alvarado's gonna get hit with a tech though. Based on what I saw. Delo's three for four from three. He got 13 points in his first quarter. He's obviously come out guns blazing. He's feeling himself right now. Zion, a good start in his first quarter. He got 10 first quarter points. So Zion, a little bit of retribution early. He had a bad game last game. He definitely has to make up for it. He is so far. Salute, uh, D Master. Yeah, uh, you know what I mean? Like me and uh, you know what I mean, Big Tone just 
just thought it'd be good, you know what I mean, for the playoffs, just, you know, do, you know, do some different games, different teams, and it's all basketball. It's going to be high competitive basketball, so it's, it's good games to cover because all these games mean something now. Now you're in the part of the season where every game counts, every possession counts, and you got to love it. As uh, I see Darvin Ham drawing up a play right here. Because I saw Scott Foster call a technical foul. So I think it was on Alvarado. I don't know if it was a double tech. Because I saw D'Lo running his mouth as well. So let's see what the refs decide. I think it's a double tech. Let's see here. They're showing a the replay. Yeah, Alvarado nudged into D'Lo a little bit. He goes right back into him. Yeah, it's probably going to be a double tech. So we're going to get D'Lo inbounded here. D'Lo inbounds to AD, gets a handoff from AD. He's being guarded by Herb Jones. D'Lo with a live dribble. He gets a screen from AD, swings it over to Torian Prince. Torian Prince to Rui. Rui with a pull up in the mid range. He's off, battle for the rebound, and Zion got it. Zion, he's going to take it across half court. Pelicans up five. Zion with a rim attack. He dishes out to Herb Jones. Herb Jones corner three, he laces it. Herb Jones laces the three ball in the corner as he's another guy that improved this game, improved his three-point shot. Official three and D guy. D'Lo pulls up from three. <coughs> he's off. Rebound Zion. We got about 22 seconds left in the first quarter. Pelicans could just hold for the last shot. Maybe .6 difference between shot and game clock. Zion, he's being guarded by Torrey and Prince. Let's see how this goes down. And Zion... Gives it off to Trey Murphy. Trey Murphy, three ball. He's off. Rebound AD with about three seconds left. Dinwiddie got it. Dinwiddie pulls up from half court. He's off, and that's the end of the first quarter. Pelicans lead 34 to 26. Son, so who, did my shit is all behind. So did they get both of them a tech or just Alvarado? Nah, it was a double tech. That was That's the fucking Scott Foster, bro. This dude, man, it's the playoffs, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep. Yep. He's setting a weak tone right now. He's setting a weak tone. Like, he's now, now, they already got one tech. They can't even, you know what I mean? <laughs> man, they got a total line now. So, like, he's now, now. This shit is crazy, bro. This This is real. Oh, well, if he, if he if he reffing tonight, that mean that punk ain't gonna be reffing with with, with us. That's oh, good. Oh yeah, gotta love. It. Oh my god, man, that's good. He ain't gonna be our referee. Jesus, man. Hello, this, guys. What's what's up, D Mass? I'm my bad. I wouldn't. Philip D Mass. Yeah. yeah, keep keep Scott Foster ass on the West Coast, man. Yeah, keep man. Him there. But then Let's again, I. Clown. <laughs> then again, I hope we don't have that that female referee either. Man. Oh, nah, man. I, yeah. Yeah. Hey, I don't give a damn. Like, come playoff time, Scott Foster, please keep him away. Please keep him away. Well, he I number one. Been... He number one. 
and then Tony Brothers number two. So exactly. That's both of them are rest of this today, game, boy. Baby. They call him Squarehead. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I think the Pelicans have learned their lesson, man. They learned that they they need to. They can't go like um, pay, uh, go crash, go running into the paint and hoping for a bailout. They need a, you, They need their shooters to like hit them short against the Lakers at least. Anyone else is fine, but right. the Lakers no. Because that's man, pretty much the Lakers' thing. <laughs> hey, hey, Marcus. Well, if he, if he want to help his team, one tech better better stop his ass. If he want to if he want to help his team, he can't help his team in the locker room because he can't even be out there on the bench. If he get another tech, so that he can he can try. To, yeah, he can be he can try to be all that tough shit if he want. <laughs> yeah, that's like you know what I mean. That's bronze over brains, man. You never want that. Right. Exactly. Yeah, so he, he can try it. Yes, sir. Okay, let's see that back. Did you have any great poupon? I didn't see that commercial in so damn long. See LeBron's back in the game. Lakers down eight points here. And it's going to be Pelicans ball. We're going to have Dyson Daniels on the inbounds. And he's going to inbound it to Alvarado. Alvarado's being guarded by Gabe Vincent. Hey, guys, play him. Play and Alvarado, with a live dribble right now, picks it up, gives it off to Nance. Nance guarded by Jackson Hayes. And Nance almost turns it over. He's able to recover it. He gives it to Zion. Zion against LeBron, pull up mid-range. He knocks it down. That's going to be a key shot for Zion. If LeBron's backing up like that, rhythm pull up. Rhythm pull up, go downhill into the rhythm pull up. Pelicans up 10. LeBron with the ball, knifing through the lane, finds Gabe Vincent, wide open three ball. He knocks it down. Corner trade ball for Gabe Vincent. Playoff Gabe might be activated. Who knows? We got Larry Nance with the ball. Larry Nance trying to find Trey Murphy and Larry Nance. He's been. Having near turnovers here, and he does end up having a tur turnover. Gabe Vincent steals it, and Torian Prince gives it off to LeBron. LeBron with the ball with Alvarado on him. He gives it to D'Lo. He's going to get it right back in this mismatch. LeBron spins baseline, pump fakes, easy. Oh, Zion came from behind and sent that back. Here comes Alvarado to Zion. Zion goes up, and wow, no call. D'Lo skips it over to LeBron for a cherry pick dunk. Wow. Okay. Really surprised, really surprised with the no cool though. Really. <laughs> I mean, no, nah, I'm just saying, man. Hey, man, it's a foul. You know, I'm mean? like these refs get graded. So if they if they want to have four grades, that's on them. As we got, oh, Zion gets ripped by Torian Prince, and Torian Prince gives it off to LeBron. LeBron finds Jackson Hayes, and Jackson Hayes throws it down. What well, was once double digits now just a three point lead for the Pelicans. Lakers on a roll right now, and Pelicans. Pelicans got to try to stop this momentum. Zion got space. Just pull up in the mid-range again. What you dancing and waiting for? And he gives it off to Trey Murphy. Trey Murphy, Dyson Daniels in the corner for three. He bricks. I mean, I don't know why Dyson Daniels shoots so much threes. Bro, you can't shoot. You can't shoot. Just pass the ball. As we got D'Lo in the mid-range, he knocks down a close jumper. Timeout Willie Green. Lakers within one. And D'Lo running his mouth right now. <laughs> Zion talking to Scott Foster about that foul call. That's not going to do you any good, okay. Zion. Trust me. Might as well talk to a brick wall. <laughs> yeah, that's 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 definitely not going to do him any good. Yeah, I hear Jeff Teague's story about Tony Brothers. Teague was talking to his mom and his sister under the basket. Tony Brothers walked over and asked Teague, 
Wow. So yeah, I heard about that. I heard about that too, sir. Yo, salute Thelma. Yeah, I ain't I ain't I ain't hear that from Jeff Teague, but that's crazy, man. Yep. Do you reckon the Lakers actually want to win this game or now or are now forced to win this game because the media told them? Nah, they want to win. <laughs> they want to win. Yeah, I don't believe in that not wanting to win thing. I don't I don't I don't really that's just my I think that they want to win. Um what are they scared of? The yeah. Nuggets? I mean, yeah. I don't yeah. there's just there's, yeah, there's nothing to be scared of because if you want to get to your destination, you gotta play them anyways. Why not play them right away and get the shit over with to see if, if you're worth it or not? Just find out now. You know what I'm saying? In the first round. Play the defending champions. You win. You got all the momentum in the world, and you feel like you should be the NBA champions. You lose. You weren't that good, anyways. Go home. You know what I'm saying? Don't don't duck nothing. Find out. You know what I'm saying? Like, and okay, so now, so now, what you want to do now? Now you want to go play a one-off game where let's say it's against Steph. You know Steph could light your ass up for 40 points in any game because it's only one game. So he could light your ass up for 40. Clay could light your ass up. And then what? Now you're going home anyway. So Oh, my God. That's what happened when you play around. Salute, Derek. Salute, uh, Terrence. That was an offensive fail all day on offensive charge on LeBron. That shit is crazy, man. <laughs> Ooh, this shit gonna be fun, man. This shit is gonna be fun to watch. Oh my god, he literally bowled over the boy. <laughs> oh god, these guys, man. They, now I know, I know, Dirk. I know, Dirk. I already know. Trust me. Uh, unless it was, unless that was Lakers. If that was Lakers, they would have called it. <laughs> oh my God, man! This is this shit is, this shit is just sad and hilarious at the same time, bro. That he literally ran over Larry Nance, bro. LeBron literally ran over Larry Nance before the boy shot the ball. You can't make this shit up, man. You can't make this shit. Up. <laughs> <laughs> oh God, man, this shit is crazy, man. Yeah, salute to everybody back. who came in, man. Yep, yep. Salute to everybody. Appreciate y'all being here. Hit that like button on your way in. We're back in action right now after the timeout. Pelicans lost the lead right here, but they maintain a one-point lead. And Trey Murphy from deep, he's off, and D'Lo gets the rebound. Here comes D'Lo. D'Lo off the bounce, covered behind the back dribble. He gets a screen from Jackson Hayes. He finds Torian Prince, who lines up a three. And Torian Prince knocks it down. Lakers in the lead. Lakers gaining all the momentum right now. Pelicans taking some dumb shots. Here comes CJ. He takes a fallaway jumper on the baseline. He knocks it down. He ties the ball game up. It's why I don't really like Pelicans too much. They just, it's not a smart team. That's just my opinion. Because we got Jackson Hayes with the ball. He's going to hand it off to LeBron. He's going to set a screen for LeBron. LeBron turns the ball over. Trey Murphy with the steal. And Trey Murphy, he gets fouled by D'Lo. Because Trey Murphy was about to just run in the traffic. Needs to relax a little bit. Relax. You know what I mean? Take it back out. But it's going to be a uh, ball going to stay with the Pelicans. Should be a sideline out of bounds here. CJ, he's going to pull up from deep, and he misses it. Just a bad shot. CJ misses a deep three, and LeBron got the ball right now. Lakers got a chance to retake the lead. LeBron swings it over to Torian Prince, and Torian Prince gives it off to Austin Reeves. Austin Reeves being guarded by Trey Murphy. 
He's going to get a screen from Hayes. He attacks, weaves through traffic. He finds Gabe for another three, and Gabe knocks down another three. Gabe Vincent, two for two from deep range, and he's going to pick up CJ here and harass him. CJ with a little blow by, pull up in the mid range. He misses it. Rebound Torian Prince. Quick outlet to LeBron. See what LeBron does here. LeBron's going to bring it out. LeBron's guarded by CJ. He wants that matchup. Pelican's eyes are on LeBron for sure. Here comes two. LeBron skips it over to the corner. Gabe Vincent three ball, and Gabe Vincent didn't even hit the rim. Here comes CJ. CJ guarded by Reeves. He's going to dump it down to Zion. Zion guarded by Prince. Zion with a face up. Zion with a blow up. Blow by. He goes up. He gets a tough layup. I mean, damn. Zion ain't going to get no calls. As Torian Prince in transition, he misses a three. Zion gets the rebound. Lakers up one. Here comes Zion. Guarded by Prince again. Zion with another attack here. And they're going to call a blocking foul. So that's going to be a blocking foul. I think that's a little payback right there because they know that they haven't been calling the fouls for Zion on his rim attacks. And that right there was just a little okay. You know what I mean? Like we're going to give you the block on that one. That boy Zion just wants to barrel through everything, boy. He knocks down the first free throw. He got one that, more on the way. That's why we know it's bullshit when they don't get the calls. That's all Zion do. So how in the hell do the Lakers get more calls, 10, 12 more calls than goddamn uh, uh, Pelicans? Tie ball game right now, 41-41. Zion, he makes both free throws, gives the Pelicans a one-point lead. And Austin Reeves, he's going to take the ball across half court. He's been harassed by Herb Jones right here. And Austin Reeves, working through a little bit of pressure, goes baseline, stops on a dime, takes the mid-range. He's off, rebound Valanchunas. Valanchunas takes it across half court himself. He hands it off to Herb, Herb to CJ. And CJ's waiting. Going to look to get a screen here from Zion. CJ's going to take a step back three. He misses it and rebound Reeves. I don't like CJ's like shot selection and shot profile, how he plays the game sometimes. And now he's caught up on LeBron. And Trey Murphy doubles. LeBron finds Reeves. Reeves to Rui. Rui takes a three. Rui knocks it down. It's just easy basketball at that point. I don't know why CJ is cross-matched on LeBron. Most likely after the bad shot, now it's scramble in transition. And Zion, he's going to take the mid-range. He misses it, and he just got to shoot that confidently. He's overthinking it. He's taking too long to let it rip. You're in the mid-range, bro. He just knocked down two free throws. Just shoot the mid-range. As they're going to call a foul here as AD misses a layup, but he's going to get two free throws out of it. I'm not sure what, what Ham and LeBron's crying about to the refs right now. Just play the goddamn game, bro. Your teammate's about to get two free throws, and here you are crying. Just shut the hell up and play ball, man. They call it. They call it. They don't call it. Just keep playing ball, man. Everything is going to work its way out with the basketball gods if you play the game the right way. It makes no sense, all this damn crying. Wait, y'all Lakers fan now, this one? Nah, we ain't Lakers fan. Just calling playoff games. Uh, uh, Kobe Jordan, just the playoffs, bro. This ain't about no fans or nothing. You know what I mean? Like, we just calling high-stakes games right now. Ain't nobody Lakers fans over here. Well, I don't know. Anybody in the chat or something like that. But anybody Lakers fans over here, bro? No doubt about it. Now, I got you, Kobe. As AD, he misses the first free throw. He got one more on the way. 
Yeah, this high stakes basketball, man. Every possession matters. Every game matters. You know, it should it should be no bullshit effort from these dudes. I like that. You know, get the cost of good basketball, and I get to watch front row and center and, and, and call out who's stepping up, who's not stepping up, who's shrinking under the moment, and who's rising under the bright lights. As AD splits the free throws, Lakers up three, and Valanchunas with the ball. He gives it off to B.I., B.I. to C.J. C.J. gives it back to B.I., B.I. with a pump fit. He got A.D. on him. He's in the mid-range, picks up his dribble. He got nowhere to go. Shot clock going down. He gives it off to Herb. Herb's going to have to take a rush shot. He misses it. Battle for the rebound. A.D. got it. That's a piss-poor possession by the Pelicans. And good defense by A.D. on B.I. Didn't let him get a good look. Ball moving by the Lakers. LeBron with a little blow by. And LeBron... I don't know what he did there, but I'm going to call that a turnover. And here comes B.I. in transition. Some long steps to the basket. And he gets a layup to go. You got to attack that rim and be physical, man. As we got Gabe Vincent with the ball. Lakers up one. He's guarded by C.J. He dumps it down to A.D. A.D. with a face up on Valanchunas. A.D. with a live dribble. Attacking. Almost lose the ball. He recovers it. Little push shot. Rims out. Rebound C.J. And CJ gives it off to B.I. B.I. with behind the back crossover. Now he's going to pick up his dribble. He gives it off to CJ. He wants it back. He gets it back. He's being guarded by Rui. Face up jab. Attack. Turn around jumper. He's off. Rebound LeBron. LeBron James speeding through half court. LeBron James in transition. LeBron James goes all the way to the rim for a left-hand layup. That's a freight train right there. <laughs> I mean, he's been doing his whole career, man. You got to give him credit, man. At this stage of his career, he's still playing at a high level. CJ three ball, he's off. And AD almost lost that rebound opportunity, but he gets it, gives it to LeBron. LeBron with a hesitation, blow by again. Back-to-back -back layups for LeBron. You got to get back and wall off that pain against LeBron James. As we got B.I. with the ball. B.I. gives it off to Trey Murphy. And Trey Murphy, they're going to call a foul here. Ball stays with the Pelicans. LeBron checks out. D'Lo checks in. Lakers up five. 355, left and a half. So we're going to have a sideline out of bounds here. Herb Jones is going to inbound to B.I. B.I. is being guarded by Rui. He goes baseline. He gets hemmed up. He got three bodies on him, and he gives it off to C.J., and they're going to call a block on Gabe Vincent right here. Gabe Vincent looked like he was trying to take a charge. Didn't work, and now Gabe Vincent is limping off the court. Held his knee a little bit. I don't know if that's the knee that's been bothering him the whole season that he had surgery on he looks to be okay now probably just bumped his knee and he's gonna go over to the bench as we got nats on the inbounds he gives it off to herb and herb takes a step back long too and i don't even think he hit the rim that was a desperation shot with the shot clock going down it's gonna be lagos ball right here 49-44 ball game. Lakers ahead looking for more. And what's the call here? Is that a is, is is it a timeout? Might be a timeout here. As we go over to the break, Lakers up five. Who you got in the Suns Wolf series? Well, I got the Suns, uh Kobe Jordan. I got the Suns, bro. I just think that they're the better team. Wolves haven't done anything yet, bro. No, like, their coach hasn't done anything yet. Their top players haven't done anything yet. And the Suns have bitched them this season. Dog walked them. This last game, at home, they got dog walked. So, I think. KD's better than anybody that the Wolves got on the court. 
we got this Ant Man versus D Book. Hey, D Book helped his team go to the finals. Yeah, he struggled in some closeout games. You know what I mean? Some 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 bad closeout games, no doubt about it. But he got more playoff experience. I'm taking D Book over Ant Man. You know what I mean? I'm taking Frank Vogel over Chris Finch in terms of the head coach battle. If you you know, not only with the 2020 chip with with, with Frank Vogel having a, a, a solid defensive team that he coached with Indiana. He was a hell of a coach with Indiana, getting them to the one seed. They were highly competitive. They gave us a whole bunch of problems. Whole bunch of problems. So I'm going with the Suns, man. I made those mistakes like years ago, like in my younger days. I always liked the up and coming team. You feel me? Like the the young team. I'd be picking them over the vet and, and I learned from those mistakes just from watching those series, you know what I mean, throughout the years. I've I've learned from those mistakes. Like, I got the Warriors beating Kings tonight and beating Pelicans the next game. And then I got the Warriors beating OKC in the first round. It's going to be a 1-8 a upset in the first round. Warriors going to beat OKC. So I'm not yeah. taking these, you know, young up-and-coming teams over – over the veteran teams, man. I'm not making those mistakes anymore. Yeah, LeBron won play Superman. Let it, let his ass keep running floor to floor. No, you, you don't even stop him. Let him make the shot. All that. Let him keep running, baby. Here you go. Come on, run. Floor to floor. Let everybody know that you Superman. Because I guarantee you by third quarter, fourth quarter, he done. He is he look at him over there. Look at him on the bench now. What's up, Cole? Salute. Yeah. Let them boys go. Let his ass run down that hill so fast. <laughs> hmm. I wouldn't stop his ass at all. Let him go. Woo, you good, LeBron. 21 years. Keep fun. Go. Hey, coast to coast, come on. <laughs> I'll let you get 100 points. <laughs> mm -mm -mm. <laughs> yeah, Kobe, I'll let his ass run until he can't run no more. Indeed, I would. Let's see, we got... We back in the action. We got inbound. D'Lo, he takes the ball across that court. He's going to give it off to AD. AD guarded by Nance. He gives it off to Reeves. Reeves trying to turn the corner. He finds Torian Prince. Torian Prince attacks. He gives it off to Reeves. Reeves to Prince. Prince lines up a three. He knocks it down. Prince knocking down three balls for the Lakers. And he gives the Lakers an eight-point lead. And I ain't going to lie. If the Pelicans don't wake up, it looks like it's going to be another blowout. Here comes B.I. now. B.I. with the handle, turns the corner, and he turns the ball over. He was caught in between passing and shooting. That's what I always say. When you attack, you attack to score. Passing is secondary. As Austin Reeves, he gets a body bump foul, and he's going to get two free throws. All right, Pelicans, keep fucking around, bro. Keep fucking around. These next two minutes and 53 seconds. You can easily find yourself down 15, 16 points if you don't be careful. And at that point, okay, it's a wrap. You right back where you was last game, getting your ass beat down. Reeves knocks down the first free throw. He got one more, and he got a chance to make it a double-digit lead. Pelicans was up double digits. Now they about to be down double digits. That's a 20-point swing. <laughs> so, I mean... That's a 20-point swing in one quarter. And Reeves catches it. Pelicans down double digits. Here comes CJ with the ball. He gives it off to B.I. And, and that's another problem with the Pelicans. They ain't got no true point guard. So I don't like McCullum as, 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 as a lead guard. As we got Zion trying to go downhill. Torian Prince trying to hold his ground. And they call a foul here. It looks like Zion just lost his footing. But they're going to call a foul here, I believe, on Torian Prince. And it's going to be a sideline out of bounds for the Pelicans. Zion trying to barrel his way down the lane. He falls down. He gets a foul call. So we got B.I. He catches the inbound. And B.I. 
gets it off to Zion. Zion trying to go downhill again. He throws up a shot. He misses it. He's just barreling and throwing up tough contested shots. Here comes Torian Prince right back to Braun. He's being guarded by Herb. Blow by LeBron to the lane. And he's get fouled. He's going to get two free throws. As LeBron James with the penitent shrug off that he likes to do. <laughs> Every time he does like some freight train shit. He likes to do a little shrug off move. Shit's funny, man. I ain't going to lie. Yo, it was good, Draven. As LeBron's going to get two free throws. And he's going to look to increase this lead for the Lakers. He knocks down the first one. He got one more on the way. These next 220 is very important for the Pelicans, man. Very important for the Pelicans, man. Zion refuses to take the mid-range pull-up. He wants to just barrel his way down the lane. As LeBron knocks down both free throws, they're up a dozen. B.I., he's going to take the ball across half court. B.I. is guarded by Torian Prince. going to get a screen from Nance here. Gives it off to C.J. C.J. gets a screen from Zion. C.J. trying to attack. C.J. picks up his dribble. Finds B.I. B.I. to C.J. Open corner three. C.J. misses it. Pressure's getting tight right now for the Pelicans. LeBron skips it over to Reeves. Reeves gets the screen from Braun. He gives it off to Braun. Braun being guarded by Nance. Now he's facing up Nance. He's going to look for a blow by here. LeBron James attacking. LeBron James almost loses the ball. He regathers himself. Three seconds on the shot clock. Two seconds. LeBron pump fakes. He draws the foul, and he's going to get two free throws. Again, Pelicans, low IQ team. Shot clock going down. You got LeBron right where you want him. What you do, you fight. You, you fall for the pump fake. You too hyped, bro. You too hyped. With defense, not only do you need the the feet, move your feet and, and, and the hunger for defense, you got to have the mind for defense too. Great defenders are able to slow things down in their mind. They're in full control defensively. And they slow things down and they understand the situation. Right there, Nance was just panicked the whole time guarding LeBron. And he gives up some easy points. LeBron knocks down the first free throw, one more on the way. And he got a chance to make this a 14-point game. Remember what I told y'all? Pelicans could find themselves down 15-16. Well, with one minute 40 left, it could be 20. Now they're down 14 after the two free throws by LeBron. Here comes B.I. guarded by Torian Prince. Gives it off to C.J. He finds Valanchunas, who finds Zion. Zion with a face-up, cushion given. He throws up a little push shot. He misses it. He gets stripped. And ball goes out of bounds. They're going to say it stays with the Pelicans. Pelicans got 11 on the shot clock. They got to go to work. Zion's getting stripped. Zion's not taking what the defense is giving him. He's trying to force it. He ain't winning like that. As we got B.I., B.I. with a jab on Torian. He attacks. He falls away in the mid-range. He knocks it down. If the Pelicans want any hope to win this game, the offense got to throw through Ingram and C.J. Because Zion's not creating shit. I'm just being a honey with you. Trey Murphy needs to bomb threes, and C.J. and, and B.I. needs to dominate in the mid-range. As Austin Reeves turns the corner, goes baseline. He finds Torian Prince in the corner. Torian Prince, he misses the corner three, and here comes B.I. B.I. with under a minute left of the game. Pelicans down a dozen. B.I. needs to go to work. He finds Zion down low for a nice stuff right there. B.I. is able to find Zion again. He found him early in the game. Back door. He finds him back door again. And Zion is able to go up and get the dunk. Now, he'll do that. You know what I mean? When he's free, he's going to dunk it. But once he has on ball and he has to create, it's going to be very tough. As LeBron James went baseline. They're going to say he got fouled. He's going to get two free throws out of this. You see how they calling everything for them? Now, Zion doing the same thing. Earl, especially early on the first quarter, he was doing the exact same thing. They was knocking his ass over. I told you. I told y'all, man. Y'all, y'all, boy, y'all better pay attention, man. 
as LeBron, he knocks down the first free throw. He got one more on the way. I mean, yeah, you know, but I don't like how Zion playing, though. Zion not taking what the defense giving them because when they playing off of you and you trying to barrel your way down the lane, I get it if they playing on you and they just riding you the whole time. But they they playing back saying you can't shoot and you just coming right to them. So that's what makes it. Zion just got to pull up in that mid-range and just, and just trust his shot. If not, it's going to be a long night for the Pelicans. They down a dozen. B.I. tries to attack. He gets caught in the air. He finds Herb. Herb to Valanchunas. And Valanchunas smokes an easy layup. Ball going to go over to the Lakers. He's just smoking easy layups right under the basket. You a seven-footer or 6'11". Easy layup. As we got Reeves with the ball, he takes it across half court. And Lakers going to hold for the last shot up a dozen. It's LeBron with the ball being guarded by Zion. LeBron, he almost turns it over. Actually, that is a turnover. His AD ain't have no thumbs. He couldn't control the ball. And Pelicans got 4.5 seconds to see if they could drop down this lead a little bit. And we got some subs. We got Trey Murphy checking into the ball game. So with 4.5, you got to run a play where you catch it at least close to half court. That's the play that Pelicans need to be running. And let's see what happens here. Zion, head full of steam, attacks. He goes coast to coast. He gets the layup to go at the buzzer. So Zion, with a head full of steam, he goes coast to coast. He gets a layup. Lakers up 10. But remember, a 20-point turnaround in the second quarter. So all the momentum is on the Lakers' side. Zion, at least, at least he gives the Pelicans something, some type of momentum going into the second half. And Marcus say Valentunas is a big, slow, stiff on his way out the league. Yeah, oh, yeah man. I don't, I don't sh I don't know, man. They're making it look good, though. It's going to be interesting in the next two quarters, next second half. It's going to be interesting. I'm telling you, boy. They ain't shit. They ain't been right since they turned around that nine point lead. Yeah, but you know, the reason why I picked the Lakers is because I just don't believe in the Pelicans, man. I just I, I don't I mean I just who don't do? like the way they play. You know what I'm saying? I Actually, just, I just don't do? like the way they play the game. Well, I mean, you know, I mean like, there's some people that you know, they had the Pelicans, you know, simply because, well, two reasons. One, because they held bent on thinking the Lakers are going to duck Denver. You feel what I'm saying? So, and, right. and, and, you know, another reason, just, just strictly out of pride, like ain't no way that you're going to let, you know what I mean? Lakers come through and, and kick your ass again type of thing. But yeah, it's tough. Yeah, it is. I mean, I mean, unfortunate, man. It's it's a. Uh, I don't know, man. It's just crazy, bro. This this shit, but it's. I mean, it's, it's a good game, but this show ain't playing like they want to. Um, this show ain't playing like they want to go to the next round. Maybe because they know they're gonna get two chances. Sometimes motherfuckers just throwing the towel early too. When they know they get another chance. Now, I don't think that's what it is. I think they're playing just like who they are. Yeah, a lot of times, you know what I mean? These dudes, like, they're just not good. So that's why they're losing. You feel me? Like, right. they just losing because they just yep. not good. <laughs> they just not good. Yeah, no, no, no. Like you said, no IQ, man. No, yeah. and then no playoff IQ. Yeah, you know, it, it is different levels to this shit, but god damn, man, y'all, y'all, 
playoff, man, is I mean, I don't know. <laughs> it should they say it's it's they have no fight in them, man. These these guys today, many of them just don't have no fight in them. They don't know how to take advantage of the situation. Mm-hmm. Lakers is is considered old compared to them. Outside yep. of the Valley Tuna, what's the name? The big slow mother they got in the middle, Orlando, yeah. you know, New Orleans. Valley Tuna, yeah. Yeah, yeah. And Lakers considered old. So how you not take advantage of them? That's I, I don't I don't get. Yep, it's gonna be it's gonna be Lakers versus Denver, man. It is what it is. You know, it's gonna be Lakers versus Denver, man. For all you know, just a rematch of the of the of the Western and, Conference and Finals Lakers, in the first round. And Lakers really don't Lakers really don't want that. I don't care what nobody say. They really don't want that. But I think the cry. I think they're gonna really try to win because I think the cry in the, through the social media and the stream world, you understand what I'm saying, was that they they're gonna duck, they're gonna lose and and duck because they're scared of, of Denver. And you know I don't like Lakers at all. I can't stand them bastards. I don't even want them getting the play in. But to but to lose a game and 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 to duck somebody, you should want them. Yeah, you should want them. I don't give a damn if it's the first round, second round, third. That that's who you should you should want. They embarrassed your ass. That's the team you want. Yeah, I don't. Yeah, I don't agree with all that ducking shit. Now again, I mean, yeah. I'm not. You know, it is. I'm just speaking from how I don't know how the Lakers feel. You know what I'm saying? I'm really speaking right. from like how I would see it. You feel what I'm saying? So. And, right. and, they, and they showing you right now in this first half, you know what I mean? Yeah, like, they are playing hard. Let me see how, you know, like, the free throw difference. A, That's the first that I look at. Two. Let me but see. But we're going to see. Oh, yeah, you got – well, they got the free throws. Oh, no, they got – I guarantee you. Oh, I ain't oh, even looking oh, at it. Oh, yeah. I bet you they got yeah, the free they, they attempted 14 free throws. Pelicans only attempted four. There you go. <laughs> there you go. See what I'm saying? You see what I'm saying? And there Pelicans go. got so 28 know, points in the paint. We already know what's happening. And Lakers got 14 points in the paint, and Pelicans got 28 <laughs> points in the paint. <laughs> I only got four. Damn. <laughs> hey, man. Hey, man. This shit, man. I'll tell you, man. Look, man, look, man. I, I, I swear, man, please hurry up. Lord, please do whatever. Hurry up, get this dude out this lead, man. Please, bro. This, this, man. Or, or just give it to him, man. Let, let, give him the rings, man. Yeah, you better. Nah, hell no. Nah. Yep, you better, hell man. Nah. Give it to him. Get this yeah, motherfucker out of here, bro. <laughs> I don't give a damn. I don't even man. care. I don't give a damn, man. Get him out of here. Uh, get nah, this I motherfucker need, and, nah, and his goddamn man. disgusting and his disgusting ass. Cult his ass, ignorant ass fans. Get them the hell out of here, bro. Nah, I need, I need, I need some ammo for the battlefield. Um, that motherfucker get a couple <laughs> rings, boy. I'm, 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 yeah, I'm sacrificed. Basically, I ain't got no more ammo at that point. His fans is gonna go crazy. I'm talking about. I ain't got paying no attention to him. All I got to do is the league. Get, yep, he the greatest. Yep, get the fuck off my goddamn page. I ain't got to listen to them motherfuckers. Yep, he the greatest. Yep, he show sure ass. Get the fuck off my page. Yeah, see, I ain't got to worry about it. No, man, this this shit, this shit is so obvious, bro. Like I say, it's so blatant. It's so goddamn blatant, bro. This shit is crazy, man. It's it's just crazy, man. It's it's just, I I don't even know, man. Really, I I don't even know. I already got fourteen goddamn. Now you tell me, we sitting here watching Ingram go to the goddamn rim. Wim go to the rim, tuners in the rim, and they they ain't, ain't no they ain't touch none of them. We sat there watch LeBron just bowl over Nance Jr. <laughs> referee looking right at him, and they ain't call. Come on, man! Come on, man! It's sickening, man! It's sickening, bro. This shit is sickening. <laughs> I'm telling you, bro. This shit is sickening, man. It is is. He said, "Will you give LeBron the ring?" I would give him ten of them. <laughs> <laughs> give 
goddamn league. You goddamn right. I, I give him 10 of them. Yep, you better than Jordan. Yes, sir. You the greatest. Get the fuck out of here. You the greatest. Get the fuck out of here. I sure would. I'll give, I'll give that motherfucker 10. Here you go. I'll, I'll give him 10. Here you go. You the greatest. Can't nobody outdo you, baby. You the greatest. Get the fuck away from here. Never show up around here. You and your cultist ass, ignorant ass motherfucking fans. Yes, I would. If that'll get him out the goddamn lead today, I will give him 10. I wouldn't give a fuck who is against. I would give him 10. Get the fuck out the lead. You give a fuck against Heat or anybody. Get the fuck out the lead. And I'm not joking. It's a bunch of stupid ass, cheating ass motherfuckers, man. It's sickening. See, y'all young bucks don't know real basketball, man. That's why y'all can put up with this shit. Y'all don't know real basketball, bro. Y'all really think this is basketball. Many of you, many of you really think this shit is basketball. This shit is disgusting, bro. Now, damn right, I'll give him 10 of them motherfuckers. Here you go. Fuck out of here, man. Disgusting ass man, and it ain't even fun to watch him. That's what the only reason I'm even watching this motherfucker because never you want to do play by play. I wouldn't even have this shit on. <laughs> I don't watch no fucking Lakers. We didn't even have this garbage ass shit on. Lying, man. This this is this is pitiful, bro. This shit is pitiful, bro. Ten point lead for the Lakers. Let's see what Willie Green is. Uh, you know, let's see what adjustments he's he's gonna make. Um, I mean, it's not really much adjustment to make. Guys got to be on that court doing what they got to do at this point. Players got to play right now, man. You know, players got to play. Um, let me take a look and see what CJ doing. Yeah, he's two for nine, one for six. He's stinking up the joint. Stinking up the joint. He shot nine shots, and six of them was from three. That's why I don't trust these guards, like these, I, these, these I don't, new age guards. I don't bro. punk. I don't watch him. That's why I'm right here in front of the computer. I don't watch it, sucker. <clears throat> I don't watch them garbage-ass, rigged-ass bums. That's why I'm right here listening to Nephew uh, uh, Wisdom. Trust me when I tell you, I don't watch him. <laughs> Sucker, fucking cultist, ignorant ass, rock a douche. You worse than that motherfucking Tyler Perry movie, rock a douche's cult. Bunch of stupid <laughs> motherfuckers, man. You ever see that movie, son, Ruthless? It's nah, I know. Called Ruthless? Yeah, nah. It's, a, it's a Tyler Perry movie. It's about a cult. That's, that's LeBron. You, all you need to do is see half of it. Even when they come on, just watch till they come on when they go into the cult and you see all them motherfuckers. That's LeBron. Everybody you're going to see in that bitch is LeBronites. Just replace them with LeBronites because that's who it is. Motherfucking cult. Well, I, damn, I forgot I forgot they, they said their savior name. I got I to gotta get the name of the uh, of the, the God that they praise. <laughs> Oh, the the uh the person that they follow. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> it's crazy. That's LeBron. He LeBron. Oh man. Yeah. 
And he yeah, I'm he looking at some replays right now. I'm seeing I'm seeing Zion going to the hole pretty aggressively. Yeah. He ain't really getting no calls. No, of course he ain't getting no calls. He only got four. Of course he ain't getting no calls. Listen these motherfuckers. Boy, I can't stand these mother bastards. They're ignorant as shit. All that goddamn noise they ain't going nowhere. <laughs> <laughs> motherfucker made all that noise and he just getting to the stop sign. <laughs> <laughs> Boy, these motherfuckers. Man, these people, man. I'll tell you, man. They think they're on the high, man. You don't slow that goddamn car down. They ain't even at the stop sign yet making all that noise. Yeah, yeah, man, ruthless, man. You got a damn cult. That's what you that's what you garbage ass motherfuckers is for that PD drug using bastard. Fucking cultists. Just drink the Kool-Aid, nigga. Poison Kool-Aid, Jim Jones. Oh yeah, yeah. Man, I ain't gonna lie. Uh, that's some crazy like for people to really be down yeah, people, to drink. Hey, man, they mind. Look, they mind, man. They low wow, self esteem, bro. They, 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 yeah, cultists, man. Cult shit is real, bro. That cult shit is real. David could, what's his name? David could tag, David could talk, whatever fucking name is down there in Texas. Jim Jones, all these, my man, that shit real, bro. Sell a false, sell a false religion, man. Yeah. Yeah, man, that shit real, man. And that's LeBron, that's LeBron, that. that's every, that's Reggie Johnson right here. He, he, he one of them. He a bro cultist. LeBron, right now, tell that bitch to drink poison through here, bring. Yeah, yeah, Master LeBron. <laughs> yeah, you greater, you greater than Joy, and I drank it. Dumb bastard. <laughs> oh, man. Man, they disgusting, man. Yeah, Dwayne. <laughs> I'm telling you, man, this shit is disgusting, man. This shit is just disgusting, bro. I don't know. Maybe. And maybe I don't need to let it get to me like that, cause I know man, this bitch gonna be gone, and he still ain't winning shit. So the referees can rig it; they can rig it all they want. He still ain't winning shit. Garbage ass bastards, man! God, they disgusting. And the sad part is, on top of them of getting all the calls, garbage ass New Orleans Pelicans even helping them. Yeah, they playing like shit, man. You know that second quarter was 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 terrible. You know, to go from being up ten. Yep, I think it was ten. Yeah, and then you you down ten. That that's. Yeah. Now you you're down ten again, wheel, man. Cause there was what there was. What's the most? Twelve or fourteen? I think. Yeah, it was, Lakers had them by like fourteen. Yeah. yeah. Just disgusting, man. You getting? You know, one time, you know, when the ref was shade and cheat. Damn, these they made it look good. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? They made, yeah, they the made it look good. good. Yeah. Man, they don't even give a fuck. They're back. Go ahead, nephew. I got you. Back into the game right now. Second half. Pelicans, Lakers. Lakers up 10. And we got CJ with the ball being guarded by Reeves. He's going to give the ball to Herb Jones. Herb Jones to Zion. Zion to B.I. B.I. with a nifty move. He pivots into a jumper. He's short. Rebound Reeves. Austin Reeves gives the ball to Rui. Rui to D'Lo, D'Lo to Braun, Braun to Reeves, Reeves corner three, Reeves knocks it down. Reeves able to knock down the corner three. He gets the scoring started for the second half. He puts the Lakers up 13. Zion with the ball again. They're sagging off of him. He kicks it out to Herb. Herb shoots a three in the corner. Herb knocks it down. Second three of the ball game for Herb Jones. And here comes Rui Hachimura. Gives it off to D'Lo. And D'Lo gives it off to Braun. Braun finds AD. AD with a face-up. 
And AD is going to look to attack Valachunas here. Let's see what he does. A little follow away jumper is off and rebound Zion. Zion Williamson being guarded by Rui. In and out move with the right hand. He goes up and he gets called offensive foul. Freight train without no brakes. And LeBron is in pain on the ground. Let's see if he's auditioning for an Oscar here. That's when they're ready to take the dive. That's when they're ready. Now he make like it hurt. He ready to take the dive. Yeah, he's holding his wrist and let's see what's what's going on here. And now, and now you need help in, in that same wrist you was holding. You getting helped off. Yeah. Well, I mean, we'll see though. But again, Zion gotta be smarter. Exactly, than that, bro. Zion gotta be smarter than that, man. All that. You just trying to man. That's all Zion want to do. Just bear. at least, at least Giannis tall enough to where he could he could he lay can it up. It. This dude Zion yeah. just and <laughs> and here's the here's the thing, man. That that makes it sad when you guys on your off season in the summer, y'all don't even work on your your craft. You don't no. work. They don't even, and you can tell because when they come back into the league, they come back doing the same thing. They, they don't have nothing new. I mean, who is the coaches? Who is the <laughs> development squad on these organizations? God damn, all Duncan Robinson did was shot threes. He set Duncan Robinson down. Summertime, Duncan Robinson came back, shoot threes, take layups, shoot mid-range. Who is the development people on these teams? Yeah, you see, but that's why when we scout for players, we look for a certain type of player because no matter who the organization is, if the player not the one waking up early, there's nothing that we can do as an organization. It's on that right. player. Right. Because the one thing you can't do to somebody is flip that switch and put a battery in their back. It got to be there already. They got to be calling you, hey, hey, coach, man, I'm up, man. Let's uh, meet me at the gym. They got to be the ones doing that. If I'm calling right. you and telling you let's go to the gym, man, they, it's going to be a short it. race. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You you don't have the mentality and fortitude. You don't yep. want it. Yeah, you don't want it. As we got B.I., B.I., he's short on the jumper, and A.D. gets the rebound. He's going to give it off to LeBron. LeBron guarded by Zion. Now LeBron got a little bit of space. He thought about the three. He didn't take it. Gets it right back from A.D. Shot clock at 10. Let's see what the Lakers do here. LeBron still got the ball. He dumps it down to A.D. A.D. with a face-up. Now he's going to attack Herb Jones, and that's going to be a foul on Herb Jones. Oh, no, they call an offensive foul on Anthony Davis. My bad. That's an offensive foul on Anthony Davis. They're going to say he elbowed Herb Jones. AD couldn't take advantage of the mismatch there. As we got CJ. CJ is going to take the ball across half court, being guarded by Reeves. CJ gives it a B.I., and B.I., he just throws the ball into the stands. Turnover Pelicans, ball goes right back to the Lakers. I don't know what B.I. was looking at right there. I think he expected Zion to go hunt that basketball, but no communication between the two. It's going to be a turnover. Reeves with the ball. He gives it off to A.D., and A.D. gives it off to LeBron. LeBron turns the corner. LeBron finds D.Lo. D.Lo to Reeves. Reeves is going to line up a three. Reeves is short. Rebound Valanchunas. Valanchunas. To CJ, CJ, he turns the ball. Well, yep, he turns the ball over. I thought it was out of bounds on Lakers, but they kept it alive and they turn over the Pelicans. Here comes Rui to Reeves. Reeves with a scoop layup. Timeout Willie Green. I mean, what are the Pelicans doing? They can't even do entry passes. As the Lakers take a 13 point lead, they got a timeout in the action. Not and, good basketball and, right now by the Pelicans. And nephew, they might, yeah, they might want, they might help in Denver. Uh, 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 Pelicans probably helping Denver. No, I'm over. Y'all ain't gonna flop here. We gonna make sure y'all ass win. Uh, y'all going see Denver, <laughs> motherfucker. No, we, uh, uh, we. <laughs> oh man, no, ain't no ducking here. Uh, uh, you ain't gonna use us as no scapegoat. Uh, uh. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, 
uh-uh, y'all ain't using us as no scapegoat. Go ahead and win, baby. Y'all take that seven seed. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. They flip the script. The Pelicans flip the script on bro. <laughs> yeah, yeah. He's like, all right, yeah. He's like, you know, you know what I mean? Like, don't worry about the media. You know what I mean? Like, we'll take care of it. Don't worry. Y'all act, go ahead, play hard, and, 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 we'll, and we'll do the rest for y'all. <laughs> Adam and oh, Wilson, dude's throwing the ball into the stands. Exactly. I don't understand these motherfuckers. I'm telling you. And Letitia. And Letitia. Yeah, they, they're flipping, the Pelicans flipping the script on their ass. <laughs> no, <laughs> motherfucker. Uh-uh. No, oh, no, man, you ain't. Bro. You go ahead and take, you go ahead and take them a sucker. <laughs> oh, my God. I told y'all, man, I ain't putting nothing past nothing, bro. I, I'm telling you, at this point, bro, I don't put nothing past nothing, man. I'm telling you. <laughs> exactly. Exactly, R.E. <laughs> and making sure LeBron and them ass win. <laughs> oh, God. So I'm looking at this commercial right now, and 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 obviously they always promote those little chemicals that you can spray on your lawn to kill weeds. But isn't weeds like good for your health? Like they said something about weeds actually being good for your health. The root, and the root of it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So it's 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 funny how they so desperate to. I know it can it can make the lawn not not look so beautiful and all that. I get that, but but they don't care. But the government, yeah, it's not about the lawn. You understand? what I'm saying the government yeah. no, the government don't give a damn about your lawn. They want you killing weeds so you don't find out that that's an herb that can heal. Yeah, yeah. See, ph 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 pharmaceutical pharmacy. Yep. Yep. Mm -hmm. Salute, uh, CWE. We getting ready to get back into this action here after Willie Green's timeout. Let's see if he's able to fire up your spark of flame under his young Pelican squad, man. They down 13 points. Here comes Herb Jones. Herb Jones is going to take it across half court, being guarded by D'Lo. Gives it to Valanchunas, which goes to B.I. to C.J. Back to Valanchunas in the post. He got Hachimura on him. He swings it out to C.J. C.J. to B.I. B.I. trying to attack. He spins. He gets the ball poked. Battle for the ball right here. And it might be a jump ball here between Zion and A.D. Let's see what the refs decide. I know AD is going to be involved in the jump ball. I just want to see if it's going to be Zion or let's see. It's going to be Zion and AD. If Pelicans want possession here, it should be a back tap. It should be basically a back tap either way. Back tap Zion if he wants possession. Back tap AD if he wants possession. Let's see who wins this battle. Ball in the air, and that's a back tap to CJ. Pelicans gain possession. Dumps it down to Valentunas. Valentunas with a quick face-up jumper. No good. Rebound AD. And Valentunas is poor from the field today. He's unplayable right now. Let's see what Willie Green decides. I mean, Larry Nance is going to get killed by AD. There's not so many things he can do right now. It's D'Lo with the ball. D'Lo turns the corner. He finds LeBron. LeBron barrels his way into the lane, and they call a foul. He's going to get two free throws. <laughs> oh, boy. Wow. I mean, yeah, there's a body bump. I mean, but that's just contact. That's, you know, like when you're going freight train down the lane, there's going to be some contact. I guess they deemed it that it knocked LeBron off balance too much. His first free throw is up and good. Lakers up 14.
Yeah, parsley. Yeah, yeah, parsley is a good, a good herb. No lie about it. No lie about it. As LeBron goes two for two, give the Lakers a 15 point lead. And these next two minutes are going to decide the game. I know you're thinking, like, damn, two minutes? Just watch. Just watch. As we got CJ with the ball, and CJ gives it off to BI, and BI attacking. BI gets to the lane. BI gets blocked. Nope. They're going to call a foul. And that's going to be two free throws for BI on an aggressive drive to the basket. I mean, you 6'8, 6'9, 6'10, whatever you are, BI. Get to that lane, man. Be aggressive. Don't settle. B.I. knocked down the first free throw. He got one more on the way. 14-point lead for the Lakers. And, again, if the Pelicans want any chance, um, they're going to have to offensively in the half court on ball. It's going to have to be C.J., and B.I., as C.J. checks out, Alvarado's in the game. B.I. is going to have to take a massive, uh, you know, usage in, in the half court because Zion's going to have to be more off ball, getting timely cuts to the basket because on ball, they're sagging off of him and he's refusing to pull up in the mid-range. B.I. knocks down both free throws right here. Here comes Austin Reeves. Austin Reeves is going to give it A.D. A.D. is going to take it across half court. A.D., Calling what he wants right now. And he's going to get it to LeBron. LeBron pops out and get it. He's going to get a screen from AD. And he wants another one. Didn't use the first one right. He uses the other one. Ball gets tapped over to Rui. Rui knocks down a three. And Rui Hachimura is a good role player for the Lakers. He's a good role player. As Herb Jones goes the other way, he misses the three in the corner. Rebound LeBron. He gives it out to D'Lo. LeBron with the ball. Let's see what he does here. He's going to get another screen from AD. LeBron finds a cutting. Reeves and Reeves gets the layup. Lakers up 18. I told you these next two minutes. I told you. Lakers up 18 now. Zion with the ball. They're sagging off on Zion. He barrels his way into the lane and he gets a layup. He can't survive like that, though. He can't survive like that. LeBron James with the ball, being guarded by Zion. He's going to get a screen from AD. LeBron draws two, finds AD. AD rotates it over to Reeves. Reeves finds Hachimura, easy layup. As the Pelicans have no interior defense right now, Valentunas is a nothing right now in this game. Absolutely zero. As we got B.I. with the ball, he draws two. A nice quick double caught B.I. off balance. He finds Alvarado. Alvarado dumps it down to Valentunas. Valentunas, he gets stripped. He regains possession. He gives it off to Herb. Herb almost gets stripped. Shot clock going down. He's barreling his way into the lane. And what's the call here? I think that's an offensive foul. I think they're going to call an offensive foul here. And ball's going to go over to the Lakers. Valentunas on the ground. He can't believe the call. Losing basketball is being played right now by the Pelicans. They're looking like a team that has zero experience. And they don't. I don't know what it is about the play-in tournament, but every time the Pelicans are in it, they choke, bro. They just fold. Like, I don't know what... I think the play-in is their kryptonite. Seriously. <laughs> yeah, either that or the Lakers are their kryptonite because uh, they keep on... I don't know why... They keep letting Lakers get the best of them for some reason. As Reeves with a crossover, dumps it down to AD. AD with a push shot, and they're going to call a foul on the ground. Yeah, Pelicans got to really think about their roster build and see where they want to go. As we got Gabe Vincent checks into the ball game, he gets all the way to the rim, but he smokes the layup. Dyson Daniels get the rebound. He gives it off to Alvarado. Alvarado to Zion. Zion barrels his way into the lane, and they're going to call it an and one. Yeah, really moved his feet. But to be fair, that first charge that LeBron took, that was that was a deep, that was a blocking foul, bro. 
because he moved. But of course, they're not going to call that on the bun. Like, <laughs> nah. We got Zion trying to convert the three point play, and he misses the free throw. <laughs> Board goes out to Rui. He gives it out to LeBron, who gives it off to Reeves. Reeves trying to work on Dyson Daniels, excellent defender. And Reeves gives it off to Gabe. Gabe lines up a three. He's off, battle for the rebound. And Nance comes up with it. Nance gives it off to Zion. Zion's going to try to go coast to coast. Power drive right there by Zion. He gets the layup to go. He makes it a 14-point lead. Timeout, Darvin Ham, as he wants to slow down the Pelicans' momentum. And that's what Zion's dangerous. Before the defense gets a chance to set, transition. Yeah, I mean, but here's the thing, though, Marcus. So that's why guys like Zach Eady, there's a lot of questions about what he can do in the NBA. You know, especially in this era, how it's played. What can Zach Eady do? Sure, he might be able to take advantage of some mismatches, maybe. I don't know. We'll see. Is he physical enough? In the NBA, we'll see, but in space, what is he going to do in space? It's ridiculous for the uh, Pelicans. Every Pels play Clippers, they want to make. Oh, every time Pels play Clippers, they want to make every shot. Yeah, be like that, Karan. Yeah, be like that. Damn, the Pels duck the Nuggets. Yeah, that's 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 gonna be the that's gonna be the narrative now. You know what I mean? Basically, whoever lost this game is ducking. Basically, <laughs> uh, it's funny the basketball talk now. Is is I mean, all I can do is laugh now because you know what I mean this is where we at because of the influence of social media and 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 even when you have dudes on national media literally saying that team should lose to duck another team i mean this is the world we live in now man um it it makes you wonder you know where's the competitive fire from these people you know where's the competitive fire they don't have it Hmm. Pels ducking. Man, stop that bull crap. Pels ducking nuggets. Pel at, at least Pels beat the Nuggets. Lakers ain't Lakers ain't beat Nuggets in the last nine games. <laughs> right. On nine against against the Nuggets. So I don't think I don't think it's Pelicans who who ducking. They just so when the regular team. playoffs start, like next week or something? I think like Sunday. Damn, they're getting plenty of rest. Damn. We're back in the action now after the timeout from the Lakers. It starts Saturday, nephew. It starts Saturday. Magic, Magic and Cleveland, Suns and Timberwolves Saturday. Okay. That's good. That's good. As we got Gabe Vincent right now trying to take the ball across half court being guarded by Alvarado. He gives it off to Larry. No, actually, AD. AD to Braun. Braun, he's going to line up a three. He's off. Rebound Dyson Daniels. Quick pass ahead. Ball goes to Alvarado in the corner. And Alvarado knocks down a corner three. Larry Nance with a tough save. He's able to save it to Alvarado. Yep. Get the fuck out here with some LeBron shit. All that bitch do is cheat and dunk. Get your punk ass. Get your ass out here. 
fucking cult his ass up out here with that shit. All that bitch do is dump. Fuck out of here, loser. As we got Braun, Braun with a, a nifty move. He up faked Zion and stepped through for a layup, and he puts the Lakers back up 13. Zion with the ball now guarded by LeBron. LeBron sagging. He gives it off to Alvarado. Alvarado to Nance. Nance to Trey Murphy. Trey Murphy to Nance. Nance takes a mid-range jumper. He's off. Rebound Reeves. <clears throat> yeah, that's the shot that you want Nance to take. That's for sure. AD with the ball. AD gives it off to Braun. Braun's probably looking for Reeves in that corner. Let's see how the Pelicans play it. Now they back on him. Braun still with the ball, guarded by Nance. Braun's dancing with it. Four on the shot clock. Pump fake. Turnaround jumper. LeBron's off. Rebound Dyson Daniels. Dyson Daniels gives it off to Zion. Zion's going to barrel his way through the lane. He smokes the layup. Rebound Gabe Vincent. Quick outlet to AD. And AD gets a cherry pick dunk. As AD was able to leak out, he went for the steal on Zion. Didn't get it. So he was already in position to leak out there after the miss by the Pelicans. Zion with the ball. He skips the ball over to Alvarado. The Trey Murphy back to Zion. Zion got all the space in the world. He didn't want to do nothing. Zion gets it back. Zion attacks. And Zion gets the layup to go. That boy Zion said, layup I want, layup me get. This boy want nothing but layups and dunks. As we got Reeves with the ball. Reeves gives it off to AD. AD takes a long two. That's off. Rebound Nance. Here comes Alvarado with half full of steam. Alvarado trying to go coast to coast, and he gets the layup to go. Alvarado goes coast to coast for the layup. Here comes LeBron. Skips it off to Reeves. Reeves to AD. AD back to Braun. Braun to AD. Nance applying some pressure on AD right here. And Reeves got it now. Being guarded by Daniels. Reeves trying to turn the corner. Reeves pulls up. Reeves is off. Battle for the rebound. And they're going to call a foul here as AD. They're going to say AD got fouled. Battling for the rebound, trying to go up with it. And AD's going to get two free throws here. AD knocks down the first free throw. He got one more on the way. LeBron checks out of the game. We got Torian Prince in the game for the Lakers. AD knocks down both free throws, give the Lakers a 13-point lead, 81-68, with about 2.10 left in his third quarter. Alvarado hands it off to Zion. Zion to Alvarado. He misses the three ball. Offensive rebound, Larry Nance, he stuffs it through. Larry Nance with a dunk in the vicinity of Anthony Davis. And here comes D'Lo. D'Lo to Rui. Rui with a quick face up. Now he's trying to attack off the bounce, and he gets a tough layup to go on Dyson Daniels. Rui Hachimura, man, he's he's a nice player, man. You know, he can face you up. He can hit the mid-range. He can hit the three ball. Now his defense ain't all that great, you know what I mean? Probably as weak as. It depends on how he feel. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. As we got Zion with the ball, Zion, he's barreling his way through the lane. He smokes the layup, battle for the offensive rebound. Zion got it. He tries to go back up, and he gets a foul call. He's going to get two free throws. So Zion, he missed the, the initial attempt, but he got a quick bounce. He's able to get that offensive rebound, strong hands, and he's able to get fouled. He's going to get two free throws out of this. First free throw for Zion is good. 
I mean, if you if you knock it down your free throws, man, just be comfortable with that mid range pull up. Why not? Just why not, man? And the second free throw for Zion, he's is up and good. Two for two from the line for Zion. He makes it an eleven point deficit for the Pelicans. Here comes D'Lo with the ball, trying to increase the lead for the Lakers. D'Lo guarded by Daniels. D'Lo's going to get a screen here from Rui. D'Lo, he pulls up from three. D'Lo's off. Rebound trade merge. He gives it off to Zion. Zion, crossover move. Zion gathers, goes up. He gets blocked by Torian Prince. Here comes Gabe. Gabe finds Torian Prince as the trail man. He thought about a three, but he gives it off to D'Lo. Under a minute left in the third quarter. Lakers up 11. And AD on the catch on the low block. He got 10 seconds. He rotates it over to Rui. Rui with a pump fake. Finds D'Lo. D'Lo three ball. He's off. Another rebound for Trey Murphy. Pelicans could go two for one here if they want to. Trey Murphy pulls up from deep and he knocks it down. Trey Murphy takes a two for one opportunity. He makes this down to single digits. Eight point lead for the Lakers. And the Pelicans could get a stop here. They'll get the last shot. D'Lo with the ball. D'Lo's working through a couple of AD screens. D'Lo probes. D'Lo. Rotates the ball, and Torian Prince gets the shot block. Pelicans with the ball with a chance to hold for the last shot. It's Zion with the ball. Ten seconds left. Pelicans down eight. Zion. He's going to go to work here. Zion attacking. Puts his head down. And they're going to say he went out of bounds. Ball stays with the Pelicans. So no foul call. It's going to be a baseline out of bounds. So 2.3 seconds left here. Look where Zion's positioned. They might try to set a screen for Zion to get a dive to the basket. Let's see what they call here. Actually, now Zion is the inbounder now. With CJ back in the game, they might try to free up CJ for a jumper here with 2.3. Zion on the inbound. And Pelicans, they don't get a good shot off. They miss it. Zion missed it. And no, nah, actually, they call a foul here. So Zion's going to get two free throws. Are they going to review to see if it was before the buzzer or after the buzzer? Let's see. What, nah, it's going to be two free throws for Zion. What they are going to take the look. Let's see. Let's see what they call here. I think Zion probably got fouled just a little bit before the buzzer went off. Let's look at his replay right here, y'all. So it's 1.3. He gets it back. Yeah, that's clear cut before the buzzer. Yeah, that's clear cut. I mean, I don't even know why they're reviewing it. Yeah, that's a clear-cut foul before the buzzer, so that should be two free throws for Zion. Easy work. And, wow, Zion has a chance to make this just a two-possession game. After all that, you know, we was thinking this game was going to be a blowout, and now the Pelicans are right back in it. So, come on, y'all, tell me what is it. So, are the Lakers ducking now? Is that how it works? So the Lakers are ducking now, and now the Pelicans not ducking no more because it unflipped now. First it was the Lakers ducking. Now it's the Pelicans ducking. Are the Lakers ducking and the Pelicans not ducking no more? As we got Zion at the time. <laughs> and, you know what I'm saying? You see how, you see how the basketball gets, you know, gets, gets, gets uh -huh. the You feel me? <laughs> this nigga missed Zion. both of Oh, he made yeah. one. Yeah, yeah, I'm about to say he made he, one. Yeah, I was about to say Zion tanking it then. You feel me? Like, um, but he still brings the Pelicans a little bit closer, point four seconds. And that's gonna be the end of the third quarter. Lakers go into the fourth quarter up seven points. 
So that was a good response by the Pelicans in this third quarter, battling back and not laying down like some cowards. That boy Marcus said AD is tired and lazy. <laughs> oh, man. It's going to be a nice fourth quarter, man. I'm liking, yeah, I'm liking what funny. I'm seeing for the Pelicans. Yeah, no doubt. Valentunas can't play in this game anymore. He's done. He's done. You know, they got to keep Larry Nance because AD soft anyways. He's not going to take advantage of any size advantage. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, keep playing uh, Larry Nance. Why not? Yeah, I don't know what Valentinus is doing. Like, he had LeBron on him, and instead of posting him up, he took a, a like face up jumper. Yeah. Like, what? What? <laughs> I, I don't know. I don't know. Let's see here. Zion got 31 points, so he's yeah, definitely responded in this game. In the, in the first half, he was pretty much the only one doing anything because I think. Uh, midway through the second quarter, he was the only one in double digits. Okay, wow. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, so let's see if in the fourth quarter, let's see if like McCullen or somebody decides to step up. Might be right, Draven. <laughs> yeah, Draven been having some weird right predictions lately, so <laughs> who knows, yeah, he, man? He, he, I, I think he called it like when the uh, when the Lakers were up by I think thirteen in the uh in the second quarter. Yeah, in the second quarter. To the, yeah, when it started to blow the game open. Who yeah, who be having some crazy predictions? Draven, Draven, and like, and they be right sometimes, man. I ain't gonna lie. So he says that the Lakers fake and they're gonna lose the lead in the fourth on purpose. Let's, I mean, let's see what happens. They already set the stage already. Mm -hmm. So, so mm -hmm. let's see what happens. I told you they had to play and make it look good. <laughs> Bro, Lakers don't want to see no damn Denver, bro. Lakers don't want to see no Denver in the first in the first round. We're getting ready to start this fourth quarter, the money quarter. And uh, we got LeBron in this game. We got Brandon Ingram in the game. Zion's getting a rest. And I think, is is AD in for this fourth? Nah, Anthony no, Davis is getting a rest. Got some haze again. LeBron James inbounds to D'Lo. He gets it right back. And let's see what LeBron James does here. He gives it off to Jackson Hayes. Who gives it to D'Lo. D'Lo's going to try to go to work here on B.I. He's going to get a screen from Hayes. Rejects it. Good defense by B.I. D'Lo finds Torian Prince at the end of a shot clock. And that's going to be a rush shot. D'Lo misses it. And here comes the Pelicans. That is Alvarado with the ball. And anytime you get Torian Prince scrambling at the end of a shot clock, that's a win for your defense. As we got B.I. with the ball. He could go to work here on D'Lo. Let's see what B.I. does. Slow attack. Finds Alvarado. Alvarado lines up a three. He misses it. And rebound Torian Prince. Brandon Ingram has to do a better job of attacking these matchups, man. As we got LeBron James. LeBron James attacks. LeBron James picks up his dribble. Finds Jackson Hayes. Jackson Hayes right back to LeBron James. LeBron James trying to go to work here on B.I. And LeBron... Waiting for something to clear up. But he's going to take a little face-up jumper on B.I. He's short. And Alvarado with a head full of steam here. Gives it off to C.J. C.J. misses a three. And I don't know if C.J. is one for seven, one for eight. But it seems like he's 
he hasn't made a shot in forever. And is that an and one for Alvarado? No, it's, uh, yeah, it's Gabe. It's Gabe. It's Gabe. Yeah, yeah okay. Yeah, yeah it's uh, and CJ is two of ten, <laughs> one of seven from three. One of seven from three. That's crazy. Gabe Vincent with the and one opportunity. He's going to get a chance at the line to convert and bring this back to a double digit ball game. Yeah, if the Pelicans want to, yeah, yeah, Marcus Ingram's goofy, bro. Like, you know, how he plays is goofy. I don't like his game at all. I don't, I, I don't, I, I don't know. I don't like his game at all. I, I just, I just think he's an okay player to me, in my opinion. He's an okay player. As we got Alvarado with the ball, he gives it off to Nance. Nance dumps it down to Ingram. Ingram finds a cutting Alvarado, and Alvarado sneaks in for a layup. Lakers up eight here. LeBron's going to take the ball across half court methodically. He's going to get a screen from Hayes, picks up his dribble, gives it off to Torian Prince right back to LeBron. He gets a little screen from D'Lo. Now he got Alvarado on him. LeBron's trying to go to work. LeBron with a couple of back down moves. He finds D'Lo, catch a shoot, wide open three. D'Lo knocks it down. That was predictable as hell. They switched Alvarado on him. LeBron knew that they was going to send two. <laughs> oh, Lord, man. As we got Nance dumping it down to B.I., B.I. got Gabe on him, and Gabe Vincent playing that pest defense. Alvarado lines up a three, and he bricks. Here comes LeBron. LeBron with the ball now being guarded by Murphy. He freezes Murphy on the blow-by, but he smokes the layup. Nance gets the rebound, gives it to Alvarado with a head full of steam. B.I. to Trey. Trey lines up a three. Trey bricks. Rebound Hayes. He gives it off to D'Lo. D'Lo gives it off to Braun. He's going to set a screen for Braun. Braun's going to go to work here. Hesitation move all the way to the lane. And he smokes another layup. LeBron's smoking back-to-back -back layups. Alvarado gives it off to Trey Murphy. And Trey Murphy throws it down. <laughs> and who's that on the ground? Is that Larry Nance or Alvarado? That's Alvarado. Alvarado is writhing in pain right now on the ground. And what happened here? So Alvarado, what happened to Alvarado? Did somebody step on his ankle? I don't get it. Yeah, he's limping pretty bad. I like to see the replay. I know he drove to the lane. Because if it was D-Load, I was done on purpose, bro. I wish I could see the replay. Because him and D'Lo already had their little beef earlier in the game. D'Lo acting like he ain't see his foot. I mean, I'm not I'm not going to say it was D'Lo because I haven't seen the replay. I'm just saying if it was D'Lo. On the pass, probably landed on someone. Hmm. Yeah, I wish I could see the replay. It's these, these broadcasts are trash. They try... They charge you all this shit. They charge you broadcast fees, regional fees, and they can't even show motherfuckers replays. <laughs> That's why I got it how I got it. <laughs> Look at Draven. Braun about to mysteriously miss easy ass layups. <laughs> uh -huh. I, I can I can handle a couple seconds. Or a minute or two behind. Shit. Yeah, no, nah, I feel you. I feel you all the way because it don't make a difference. See me if I'm if I'm by myself watching the game, I don't give a damn how many exactly. seconds is behind. I'm just watching the game. Uh -huh. You know what I'm saying? All these damn fees. Cause really, all you need is the internet and the fire stick do the rest. That's it. That's it. That's all you need. That's and, and you see, you see what I told you. You see what uh uh <clears throat> damn direct TV did direct TV uh did they said hell with all that satellite shit I can get put away the satellite and just get these motherfuckers just straight uh 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 um uh through the internet through uh you know through the stick yeah they don't even have yeah. satellite no more 
stream streaming. I couldn't even get it out. I can just give it to a straight streaming. Shit, I ain't got to pay off for all these damn satellites. That's extra money. Yeah, it took them, the it took them long enough to join the party. Exactly. <laughs> oh boy. Yeah, I still got that damn direct TV satellite in my damn yard. <laughs> they they come pick it up? No, once you give it, they, you know, they don't reuse it. I mean, they can refurbish, but once you got it, you got it. It's yours. Might as well sell it. Might as well sell it. Yeah, to who? Ain't nobody doing satellite <laughs> no more. Shit, sell it to who? Somebody. Uh, Somebody might want to do, I don't know, some bootleg. They're, yeah, they're fine. So, yeah, it's always somebody. Yeah. There's always somebody. Mm -hmm. So I'm I'll seeing a replay that. now. And, oh, I think he ran into that shit that be in front of the rims. Or some, no, I think Torian Prince stepped on his leg. Yeah, yeah, Torian Prince stepped on his foot on his ankle. But we back into action here. Brandon Ingram with a quick mid-range shot. He misses it. And LeBron gets the rebound. And Torian Prince attacks. Torian Prince throws up a wild shot. He misses it. AD misses the putback. He gets offensive rebound, reverse layup, and good. That's the only problem that you're going to have to deal with, though, because you can't play Valentunas. Is them rebounds. The Lakers going to get some second chance opportunities, AD, down low. As we got Alvarado, Alvarado is going to get up to Nance. Nance not looking to score here. Shot clock going down. He gives it off to CJ. CJ gives it back to Nance, who gives it back to CJ. Shot clock going down, and CJ's got to take a terrible shot. From three in the corner, he bricks it, and Alvarado gets him a second chance. CJ attacks. CJ pump fakes. He steps through. He gets a shot swatted. <laughs> oh, man, that boy CJ playing like dog shit tonight. As we got LeBron James with the ball, LeBron James taking his time, gives it off to Reeves, Reeves to AD. And AD, he's going to face up here on Nance. AD with a back down. Let's see what he does here with a shimmy. He loses the ball. And did they call a foul? I mean, I guess they called the reach-in foul on Nance. I just thought AD was not. Actually, it's going to be out of... Yeah, yeah, it was a foul because the shot clock got reset to 14. I just thought that was a weak-ass move by AD, but the refs thought different. Lakers up 11, 91-80, 7.38 left in this ball game. Brandon Ingram's going to the bench. CJ McCollum's going to the bench. Who's going to create in the half court? It's going to have to be Zion. Ball gets deflected out of bounds here by Nance, battling with AD. Lakers keep possession. So Herb Jones is going to have to, you know, knock down some threes. Trey Murphy is going to have to knock down some threes. AD gets the inbound. He gives it off to LeBron. LeBron guarded by Zion. LeBron gets a switch. Now Nance on him. He pulls up from three. He bricks it. Battle for the rebound. And Trey Murphy... Drops it down to Zion. Zion takes it across half court. Zion got space. Zion attack. Zion quick layup. He gets it to go. That's 33 points for Zion as he's responded. He's taking it to the basket. It's working tonight, but still got to improve your game, young fella. But right now, you are dominating in that paint. I'll give you that. Austin Reeves with the ball. Austin Reeves attacking. Picks up his dribble, finds AD. AD with a face up. AD. Barreling his way to the rim. He smokes the layup. Crying for a foul. Rebound Larry Nance. He gives it off to Alvarado. Alvarado's pushing pace. Crossover move. He finds Trey. Trey Murphy lines up a three from deep. He knocks Why? it down. Jesus, he made it. <laughs> Trey Murphy knocks down a deep three. And he makes it a two-possession game. Y'all, like I said, Herb Jones got to knock down three. Trey Murphy got to knock down threes. No B.I., no C.J. All these guys are going to step up. Herb Jones steps in. And he gets a steal. Here comes Alvarado. He slows it down. He slows it down. 
He pulls it back out, picks up his dribble. He gives it off to Trey Murphy. Pelicans down six. Can they make a push? Trey Murphy with the ball. He finds Zion. Zion, plenty of space. Zion, blow by. Zion to the lane. He smokes the layup, but he gets fouled. He's going to get two free throws. That should have been an yeah. and one right there for Zion. You got a strong hand layup, but you're going to get two free throws nonetheless. He is tired, bro. You can see it. Son, yeah, this I mean, nigga can't make no layup. This dude, man. <laughs> These dudes is horrible, man. And that's a strong hand, too. No, but on that possession, he was gassed, man. Like, yeah. literally, when Jose, when Jose threw him the ball, you could see. He didn't even want it. He didn't even want the ball that, that possession. Yeah. As as he misses the first free throw, and he's gonna get one more. All these all these free throws count, Zion. Come on now. If you're gonna smoke a layup, you gotta catch him at the line. As Zion, his second free throw, he gets it to go. So he splits the free throws here again. But it's a brand new ball game. It's anybody's ball game. So let's see who's gonna duck the most here. It's D'Lo with the ball. D'Lo shrugs off Alvarado. And LeBron with the ball. He gets a screen from D'Lo. Now he backs it out with Zion switched on him. LeBron James off the bounce. Seven seconds on the shot clock. He got to go to work. LeBron James, he got absolutely nothing. Good defense by Zion. LeBron James, he gets a shot block. And here comes the Pelicans. Herb Jones finds Zion to Alvarado. Alvarado lines up a three. He knocks it down. Jose Alvarado, three ball. He makes it a two-point game. And here comes the Lakers. It's going to be Austin Reeves, guarded by Alvarado. Let's see what Austin Reeves got. He's going to get a screen from LeBron. Austin Reeves turns the corner. Austin Reeves gets a layup to go. That's a nice little finger roll right there by Austin Reeves as he's able to quiet the momentum down a little bit. Timeout Willie Green. Lakers up four, 93-89, 521 left in the fourth quarter. And the press is up in it right now players are getting tight let's see who's going to perform on the pressure ad ad tired keep ice on him zion he can't move them feet in space <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah. Crazy, man. If them boys lose, man, I ain't gonna lie. I don't like believing in that shit, but sometimes shit just be too weird, man. Motherfuckers, all of a sudden they forget how to play. They forgot what they was doing right. You know what I'm saying? Let's see, man. Let's see, cause the spread is, uh, they got Lakers plus one point five on the spread. That's what Vegas put it at. Um, so let's see what happens. Because it started off, I think it was Lakers one and a half. And then for some strange reason, after the blowout, all the money came on the Pelicans and flipped the line and turned the Lakers into the underdog. So let's see. Paying close attention, man. Let's see. But it's a yeah, good Lakers. game. Nonetheless, you know what I mean? Like, that's all fans can uh, ask for. A good game, man. Lakers underdog, huh? <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. And again, so I give credit to Pelicans coach Willie Green. He changed some things up. He, he benched his two best offensive players. You know, even though Zion has been playing the best today, but CJ and B.I. hasn't really been giving you much. He put in his energy, guys. He got Nance out there. He got Alvarado out there. And then, you know, obviously Herb Jones with the defense. And then Trey Murphy knocking out some big threes. And he could defend as well. You know, hey, man, five minutes left in this game. Execution is going to win. Let's see who executes. Yeah, if I'm Willie Green, I'm sitting down CJ for the rest of the game. 
I'd rather have Alvarado as my point guard because he's going to give me tremendous defensive energy. He can handle the ball, and he's just going to be a catch-and-shoot player. I don't need him to create on ball. Just move it within the system and, and let Zion go downhill. Or we got Trey for the catch-and-shoot. We got Herb for the catch-and-shoot. Alvarado for the catch-and-shoot. And Larry Nance, he can duck in as well. So I'm keeping this lineup that 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 got me back into this ball game as a coach. And that's what Willie Green is doing. Same five that's been battling their ass off. Keep them on the court. B.I. ain't doing nothing worth them. And C.J. already got his flight booked to Cabo already. So I'm, I'm, I'm keeping his ass on the bench. Can't guard a clone, can't guard his own shadow, and he's not knocking down shots. You're unplayable, CJ. But we're right back into the action. Pelicans down four. Alvarado with the ball. Alvarado with a blow by. Alvarado finds a cutting Zion. And Zion throws it down. Good job by Alvarado keeping his head up, but he kept his eyes on the rim. That gave Zion the opportunity to cut without the defense noticing him because Alvarado wasn't looking at Zion. As we go with Reeves right now, LeBron got the ball. He's got Alvarado on him. He passed over to Reeves, and Reeves, that pass gets deflected. It's going to stay with the Lakers. They're up two, but they got five on the shot clock, so they're going to have to catch the ball and go to work right away. Five seconds on the shot clock. D'Lo's inbounding to Braun. Braun, he's going to rise up for three, and Braun bricks it. Rebound Larry Nance. Here comes Alvarado, guarded by D'Lo. D'Lo was yapping at him earlier. Alvarado got some confidence. He finds Trey Murphy. Trey Murphy to Herb Jones. Herb Jones, 10 seconds on the shot clock. Zion with the ball. They sagging off of him. He finds Larry Nance. Larry Nance, corner three, that's short. That's the shot that the Lakers are, is willing to give up. They purposely helped off of Larry Nance, and Larry Nance couldn't convert. Austin Reeves with it. He gives it to Braun. Braun with the ball. Braun's trying to back down Alvarado. He skips it over to Rui. Rui attacks. Rui picks up his dribble. Rui got nowhere to go. Austin Reeves deep three. Austin Reeves in and out. Battle for the rebound. Larry Nance got it. Alvarado throws it up to Zion on the alley-oop. And Zion throws it down. And it's a tie ball game. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> the Lakers look like... Whatever. Uh, Reeves with the ball. Reeves gets to LeBron. He's guarded by Alvarado again. Now Pelicans send two. Ball gets reversed. And AD gets it. He smokes the layup. He gets it back and he gets the layup to go. Timeout Willie Green. Not sure why Willie Green is calling the timeout right here. He's got all the momentum. Don't tell me he's going to put in some players and take out the guys that got him where he's at right now. Let's see. Let's pay attention to the substitutions of Willie Green. Let's see what he does. Because now you're calling the timeout. You're giving LeBron a break. The Lakers are on their heels right now. Keep attacking them. Why are you calling the timeout for, bro? Man, Willie Green is going to make sure Lakers get Dallas. I mean, uh, Denver, bro. Denver. He's going to make sure. Oh, man. Uh -huh, I told you. I tell you, we said, no, mama, y'all ain't trying that shit play like y'all. Let us come back. Uh uh. Hell no. I don't care which way. I, I ain't lie. I want Lakers lose. I don't care if they're tanking, the Pelicans trying to. I want to see them bastards lose. I don't give a damn. I don't care which way. Rig lose, lose, lose. I don't <laughs> give a damn. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh God! I don't see no garbage ass bastards lose cheating bastards up top ball game. Yeah, I just want to see these bastards lose. As we got Alvarado, he's gonna take it across half court here. Alvarado gives it off to Zion. Zion, now he got AD on him. Zion with a bully ball move. Left hand layup is good. Zion says, I'm getting my points in the paint no matter what. And he Side don't games. get no fouls. Yeah, no fouls. And he fouls don't get in. no fouls. Yeah. Uh -huh. And now 
and now and now Darvin Ham calls a timeout. I don't understand all these timeouts. I mean, did you not get enough time to talk about what you was talking about? Yeah, yeah. I can tell you what they're talking about. Look, man, they trying to let us win. Uh, 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 look, 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 look. Y'all need y'all missing shots. <laughs> I see, I see what what you call, I see what the coach doing. He trying to let us win. Y'all go out there and miss these shots, damn it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna call That's time crazy, out too. Man. <laughs> yeah, it's like, bro, you call it time out for, bro. Like, you ain't get enough time on the last one. What's up, Alex? <laughs> y'all see what he's doing? Don't y'all see what he's doing? He tried. No, nah, man. I want y'all miss shots, layups. Let the ball go out. God damn it. Uh uh-uh. uh. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, man. This shit is funny as shit, man. <laughs> Take a look at um what's up Alex? Let's see what's <laughs> going down. Man, you can't make this shit up, bro. I swear to God. You, you can't make it up, bro. You can't make this bull crap up, man. These guys nah, is funny, man. Definitely can't. As we have the inbounds right here for the Lakers. And Ball gets deflected. It's going to stay with the Lakers. And C.J. McCullen is back in the game. And I don't see no B.I. So let's see what Willie Green's thinking about here. Oh, no, don't worry. C.J. going to all of a sudden know how to hit threes. Watch. As we got Reeves with the ball, he dumps it down to LeBron. LeBron on a face-up. And LeBron trying to attack. LeBron with a slow attack. And he gets fouled. He's going to get two free throws. So LeBron's trying to attack midgets. And he's going to go to the free throw line right now. I'd like to see the replay on that one. Because that was a slow gather from LeBron James. I'd like to see that replay. Let's see here. So LeBron attacks. One, oh, yeah, I guess they're going to call a hook on CJ. What a weak foul. I mean, yeah, I could see it. As LeBron knocks down the first free throw, he got one more on the way. He gives the Lakers a 96 to 95 lead, and he's looking to make it 97 95. LeBron James, the veteran, the old Wiley veteran. Let's see. Let's see who turns up to to you know who turns out to be the key factors down the stretch. You got three minutes left. This is money time. Lakers up two, and CJ he's gonna take the ball across half court. CJ with Reeves on him, he's gonna hand it off to Alvarado. Alvarado's gonna get a little bit of a screen from Nance. Alvarado blow by Alvarado dumps it down to Nance, and Nance throws it down. Another good job by Alvarado with the blow by moving the defense. And getting his guy easy shot. D'Lo with the ball. D'Lo off the bounce. D'Lo attack. And they're going to call a foul for D'Lo. That's bad defense right there by the Pelicans. Guys ain't moving their feet. I don't like that defense by the Pelicans. It's going to be a side out for the Lakers. Look at the replay. If they show it. Just a bad reach in right there. Inbound to D'Lo. And Zion to the locker room. I saw him pissed off. Is he hurt? As we got LeBron on the face up on Herb. LeBron takes a contested shot. He knocks it down. LeBron on the face up. He takes a contested shot. He gets it to go. And here comes CJ. Lakers up two. Alvarado got it. Alvarado trying to turn the corner again. He gives it off to CJ. CJ, he's trying to attack. And CJ. Finds Trey Murphy. Trey Murphy off the bounce. He throws up a floater. He gets it to go. Haymakers being thrown back and forth right now between both teams. Pelicans had to fight all the way back in this game. It's tied. Two minutes left. D'Lo with the ball. D'Lo being guarded by Alvarado. He's going to get a screen from Braun. D'Lo gives it off to Braun. We know two is going to be sent at Braun. It's a matter of when. Two gets sent now. And LeBron James turns the ball over. Timely double from the Pelicans. Herb Jones gets the steal. 
Alvarado turns it over right back. Here comes Reeves. Reeves slows it down, waits for his team. He finds D'Lo, D'Lo to Reeves. Reeves on the attack. Reeves throws the alley-oop, and AD gets the dunk. It's crazy right there, man. Alvarado threw the ball away. That was just a terrible play by the young fella. Had a chance to slow it down and get a good shot and take the lead. Now they got to hope for a tie right now. Or they could take the lead from a three. CJ, he pulled. Nope. Actually, he dumps it down to Nance. Nance gets fouled, and he's going to get two free throws out of it. Pelicans with 13 turnovers. Lakers with eight. And that was a good last second pass right there by CJ. I thought he was going to rise up and take a bad contested three, but he dumped it down to Nance last second. Nance drew a foul. Now the next step is he got to hit these free throws. You have to. It's money time. Are you going to fold? And Nance misses the first free throw. As we see B.I. on the bench, realizing that he's whacked for not being able to be on the court in crunch time. You call yourself a star player. You call yourself one of the best uh, players on the team. It's crunch time. It's money time. And you can't be on the court. It's a damn shame. As Larry Nance splits the free throws, Lakers up one. Austin Reeves, he's going to take the ball across half court here. Under a minute left in this ball game. It's crunch time. Here comes Reeves. Reeves turns the corner. Reeves finds D'Lo, wide open corner three. D'Lo cashes it. That's a big time three by D'Lo right there. He gives the Lakers a four point lead, a two possession lead. And again, somebody helped off the strong side. Somebody helped off that strong side. And that's a sin. As Reeves, he turned the corner. Let's see this replay right here. So Reeves turns the corner. Wow, Dyson Daniels, man. Wow, he got mixed up a little bit. He was in bad position from the beginning. Why was he so sunk in the lane like that from strong side position? I don't understand. Yeah, Dyson Daniels was, was in a bad position, Marcus. Why was he so sunk? And you're going to give D'Lo a wide open three? Come on, man. That's that's just bad defense, man. That's just bad defense. <laughs> Zion got 40 points. This is crazy. Getting ready to go back into the action here. Just a quick 20-second timeout. Lakers up four. 50 seconds left in the game. All Herb in Jones the is going to inbound. All in the paint, except for the free throws. As we got C.J. McCollum with the ball. Let's see what CJ does. He hasn't done a damn thing. He falls away from close and he knocks down the jumper. He makes it a two point lead for the Lakers. And believe Lakers <coughs> call a timeout here. So, two point lead here. McCullum, he's able to hit a big shot. He's three for 13, but it's all about when you make them. And he's able to bring the Pelicans within two. Lakers call a timeout. And let's see what Darvin Ham draws up.
Dwayne Richards say game over. I must be way behind then. Mm-hmm. Way behind because the other game is um starting now. Or about to start. Yeah. LeBron is cheesing, smiling. It's disgusting. Well, they got like 30 seconds if it makes you feel better, but it's over. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, though. Yeah, I'm seeing it. I'm seeing that they got uh 38 seconds in, and LeBron about to inbound it. But it's over. Yeah, the game's not over yet. <laughs> yeah, the game's not over yet. I'm, I'm thinking, I'm like, God damn, I'm in a whole other universe. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, I'm refreshing ESP. I'm refreshing everything <laughs> I got. I'm like, damn. Well, you know when he starts cheesing, it's over. <laughs> I'm the snail in the race right now, cause damn. <laughs> As we got Braun getting ready to inbound, Braun's gonna inbound to D'Lo. D'Lo gives it right back to Braun. Braun gives it right to Reeves. And let's see if 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 Braun wants the ball in crunch time. Reeves got it right now. He gives it off to Braun. Braun with a face up. He got Dyson Daniels on him. Braun's going to try to go for the kill shot. Braun attacks. Braun with a follow-away jumper. Braun airballs. AD gets the rebound, and they're going to call a foul. AD's going to get two free throws. And again, this is simply the fact that you couldn't play Valanchunas. That rebound was always going to be a chance right there. Um, that's a tough break for the Pelicans, man. Tough break. But even... Yeah, but even if it was the last four, 14 seconds or 30 seconds, you put him in there just for rebounds. What the yeah, fuck? Yeah, just for I the rebound. You're right. You're right. Because it, yeah, ain't, it well, ain't nothing about the offense right now, basically. Right. I got you. I got you. He ain't even got to yeah. run down the field. It's, it's, yeah, that's crazy. Yeah. Because you, LeBron just airballed. You feel me? That was an airball. Yeah. He gets bailed that's, out because AD gets the offensive rebound. That's, yep. that's crazy, bro. I told you. Yeah, that's a tough break, man. That's a tough break uh, for no, the Pelicans. I told you they, they made sure Lakers were going to play Denver, bro. They wouldn't fall for that shit. Them motherfuckers was not falling for the banana in the tailpipe. No, bitch, y'all going to face Denver, motherfucker. And AD knocks down both free throws, and Pelicans going to call a timeout to try to advance the ball past half court. So AD knocks down. So AD is AD with the pivotal offensive rebound and two free throws. I mean, if it was up to LeBron, LeBron would have had a walk-off air ball. Yeah, you know, it's LeBron, crazy. LeBron, yeah, LeBron tried to be Mr. Clutch. You know, he takes a exactly, tough jumper Dwayne. and he air balls it. Gets saved by AD. The same guy that the Lakers fans want to run out of town. He's been saving y'all ass every playoffs. Well, you know them. That's that's the Bronyites, man. That's them cultists, motherfuckers. That's them cultists, man. There ain't nobody. Ain't nobody but them cultists, motherfuckers. If you don't help their king, if you don't help their savior, you bad. Look at LeBron. Look at LeBron acting like he's the coach. No, not the coach. The general. Man, manager. Darvin Ham ought to be ashamed <laughs> of himself. Look at Darvin Ham acting like he he the player and he listening to LeBron. Man, I don't feel sorry for Darvin Ham at all, man. Exactly, because you kissing LeBron ass, nigga. Yeah, and LeBron, yeah. And LeBron want LeBron want fall your stupid ass, your dumb ass clown. Hey, your dumb ass clown. Fuck out of here. As we got Pelicans going to inbound the ball right here. It's going to be Herb. 
Let's see what they got here. We got 14 seconds. They got to go. And then CJ, CJ with a blow by. CJ gets an easy layup. Plenty of time here. Reeves get the ball. Reeves going to get fouled. And he's going to get sent to the free throw line. Reeves chokes one free throw. Anything could happen. We got Austin Reeves at the line right now. Austin Reeves makes the first free throw. He got one more on the way. He could push this back to a two-possession lead for the Lakers. See, that's all. That that's also what happened when you miss your free, uh, free throws, motherfucker yeah. Zion, missing free throws and shit. So the Pelicans don't have no more timeouts. They're down four. And McCullen turns around. He finds Larry Nance. Larry Nance dunks it. Now they're going to have to get into full court pressure mode here. They got a two. Not enough time here. LeBron gives it off to AD. And they're going to say AD gets fouled. And AD is going to get two free throws out of this. So AD knocked down two free throws. This game is essentially over. Or oh, he can miss it. Yeah, that's true. Shit. Because they ain't got no timeouts. So let's see here. Lakers shot 27 free throws and the Pelicans shot 15. <laughs> and the Pelicans got a, and the Pelicans got 62 points in the paint. Yeah. Damn. <laughs> this shit yeah. crazy, man. Uh-huh. Wow, yeah. man. I'm dominating the paint, and I ain't getting touched at all. <clears throat> wow. They ain't getting no fail calls. No fail calls, motherfucker bro. shot. Now it's about to be 30 feet, obviously because of the fouls, but it is it is what it is, these late fouls. Um, yep, AD knocked down both free throws. This game's a wrap. You know, Pelicans don't got enough time. As McCullum races through, he throws up a last second heave. No good, and that's ball game. L.A. Lakers win 110-106, and they book their spot into the playoffs as the seventh seed. They're going to face off against the Denver Nuggets in a, in a Western Conference Finals rematch, this time in the first round. I wonder, I wonder what happened to Zion. He left the game. He didn't come back. Nah, he ain't come back. <laughs> and he looked pretty pissed off, too. I don't know if he got the call or something. I don't know what happened, to be real. I don't know what happened on that one. He seemed like he was okay. I don't know what happened to him. I mean, I got to see the report. Maybe they just exactly. go, you know, bring up a, 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 a bogus injury and say it was his ankle or some shit. But I don't believe it because he was dominating. So, And they was on a good run. And then guess what? The coach Willie Green called that random ass timeout that we talked about, you know what I'm saying, right. out of nowhere. So I, I don't, I don't, I, I don't know, man. It's, and and why and why Ingram wasn't back in the game? I told y'all. Yeah, man. I don't know. Yeah, see, I told y'all he put CJ back in the game, and CJ was playing worse than Ingram. At yeah, least Ingram could I, help I, you with some type of rebounding. Yeah, I told you they wasn't going for that shit, bro. Pelican said, fuck no, fuck, fuck Vegas. Wow. Yeah, yeah, but he purposely choked at the realists. He said, no, fuck Vegas. Y'all gonna play, y'all gonna play Dallas. I mean, damn, I keep saying Dallas. Y'all gonna play Denver. Denver, yeah. Yeah, y'all, y'all gonna play Denver. No, we ain't gonna help y'all ass. Uh-uh. No, sir. I'm telling you, bro. Oh, boy. I'm telling you. Mother come back. Just then when you come back, you take out the people 
who brought you back. Come on, man. Come on, bro. Y'all stop this foolishness, bro. Come on, man. Oh, man. That's crazy. Yeah, it's, 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 it's definitely crazy. Yeah, hey, man, this, this shit is crazy. Come on, man. No, Will, Willie, no. Willie said, nah, we good. Salute, Willie Sosa. Said, nah, we good. What's up, Sosa? Uh-uh. I ain't falling for the banana in the tail. I ain't falling for the banana in the tail. Y'all got it. We, yeah, Salute, we let y'all go ahead. Yeah, we let y'all go ahead and... Uh, uh, take on Denver. <laughs> oh man. These motherfucking rigged ass, stinking ass motherfucker. How I many they got what 68 points in the paint? Yeah, something like that. Either 68, 68 or 62. 68 goddamn points in the paint. Yeah. But it wasn't good enough to get fouled, apparently. But no fouls. No, no fouls, no fouls. Ah, I tell you, man, you can't make this shit up, bro. Can't make it up, man. This Not is, at all. What's, what's up, Connie? This is the weakest shit I've ever seen in my life, man. I ain't even lying. This shit is truly weak, man. I guess I guess we'll get a better game out of um uh 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 the, the Golden State and Yeah, I don't think I could call that one because I got to make a move in like ten minutes. Oh no, no, we ain't calling. Yeah, no, we ain't calling that. Oh no, we ain't calling okay. that. We good. Yeah, I'm ready to shut okay. it down anyway. I just we just did this one. I'm gonna go ahead and shut yeah. it down. Appreciate everybody for coming over. Appreciate you. Appreciate no, you. No doubt, no doubt. Appreciate yeah, everybody, yeah. man. Hit that like button, man. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Y'all hit that like button. Hit the subscribe button, man. Appreciate everybody. I definitely appreciate everybody for coming in, man. Yes, sir. So I'm gonna. Go look at this Golden State game, man. We're gonna we gonna go from there. Appreciate you, Miss Susan. Right. Appreciate you, the master. But we definitely be mm -hmm. tomorrow now. So y'all be here tomorrow if you're able. Oh, man, yeah, 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 yeah. No doubt. Yeah, no doubt. No doubt. <laughs> yeah, I'll be here. So, yeah. Yeah. All right, yes, so y'all have a great night. night. Okay, y'all too yeah. now. Nice. All right, Leticia. All right, everybody. Hey, man, hit that like button, hit the notification button, man. Tell your family, tell your friends, man. I appreciate y'all for stopping in, man. Good job again, nephew, the nephew uh, wisdom, man, and everybody for stopping by, man. Okay, shift, shift. Again, man, y'all want these play-by-plays. -play. Keep going, man. Show your love even in the uh, super chat, man, or the, or the cash app, man. Keep the stream going. Until tomorrow, the Miami Heat play this. Philadelphia 76ers, man. So until tomorrow, I'm Big Tone for Big Tone Open Sports Talk. Peace.